se sa estre se matso ba sky tsheka ka mo SRT ya motom go na le ke sa SRT the first SRT there must be sa estre if as gona se in one of the rooms i'm sure check eh uh, yeah eh uh, no chill where are you no chill where are you eh uh, i want to add no chill i want to add marco so we can have a decent conversation now i want to fight guys i haven't been fighting for quite some time i've been a good boy uh, now i want to fight marco let me add you my leader ask us decent questions and will answer as polite as possible <laughs> my g has it i'm easy i'm easy i'm nice ah you know dog it's been a minute yo it's been a minute no man i haven't yeah. been i haven't been live for quite some time because of other commitments so today what i want is just fight and you know if you want fights if you want violence in the most is the right person Yeah yeah no we need to we need ah, to we need the right. president to address us. Yeah uh, he must uh, he must address. He, he says uh, so he was on 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 no chills podcast so they asked him mm-hmm. a question and he says no uh DJ coach is broke uh the RS7 is repossessed the M4 is repossessed the 63 the S3 the A45 the what what and I just, just went outside to show to show them the the same cars literally the same cars which are repossessed and i have the certificate here so now i want to fight today so let me see if ndamus is not here and i know when i have you when i have you uh i know when are you gonna you gonna you gonna kill him with a, a versace blanket of 25000 he's drunk i'm here also uh, for me not i'm, I'm coming here not as a forex trader but as a, someone wants to learn and understand thank you that. and and you're gonna you're gonna ask us uh questions. proper questions we yes. thought yes yes Pro- so uh my first question and I'm, i always wanted to ask you guys you guys are forex traders you're making millions and billions i don't know but why is it why do you guys have like competitions amongst you like this always someone who want to talk bad about you and why do you talk bad about you, yourself like what is happening is is that how it is is that how you guys market yourself so what what's happening go first marco okay first okay first and foremost right i don't really i used to right i yeah. used to i i used to do that it used to be a situation of um you know in this industry it's almost like eat or be eaten you get me because okay. yeah it's either be um it's either you eat or you be eaten in in regards to the fact that a lot of forex traders are going to hate you if you're doing better than them you yeah. understand so when you're yeah. doing better than anybody in general in life yeah. when you yeah. when you when you're overcoming um another person's wealth or um when when when, when they look at you and they're like eh this guy you know we've been in this industry for 10 years this guy's doing it in 3 years they're going to hate on you right yeah. but it's almost yeah. a situation of you know what i'm going to make you choke on my success okay it's just it's just to prove a point like listen i'm going to make you choke on my success to a point where you're going to suffocate and you're going to want to fucking get a hit on this person and take him out you get me a situation where it gets so bad that you 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 want to just you know this guy makes you so angry it's such an aggro to you that you just want to eliminate this individual from the earth even because it gets yeah. that bad you understand yeah. because yeah. these guys will come at you come at you and if you're going to just let it slide let it slide let it slide right then you're going to become like a little puppet mm-hmm. they're going to be they're going to be they're going to be at you like ah oh, this guy this guy is 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 nothing we can continue to swear at him we continue to um talk bad on his name if you want to call it that or we can continue to just um you know um ravish this person in dirt and nobody's going to do anything but when you attack when you when when they see that this guy doesn't just stand back yeah. that's why people you see on my side i used to challenge everybody now nobody wants to challenge i yeah. used to challenge everybody i'm at that point i'm at that point where people know when they put me on a live i'm there and i'm ready like 
Yes. I'm a one man on I'm there and I'm ready and you get me? I, I feel like that the reason why you are so ready is because you are authentic. Cuz I mean, it, you always going to be so scared about I, it, any question if you know that you are not doing things right. So I feel like the reason why you so nice and ready for answering the questions is because you know you're legit. I don't know, I'm just adding on top of what you just said. Yeah. You know? so so, yeah, let, let me answer on my end as well. Yeah. Uh, no chill. Sure. Not even one video of me. You can surface the internet. You can check anywhere and everywhere. You will never find me speaking about another trader's business. Yeah. There's a lot yes. that I, I know, trust me. Uh, for example, saying Bani Bani is renting Kai Kais, Bani Bani is renting a car, Bani Bani yeah. car has been repossessed. Yeah. Even when I hear such, for me, for me, when I hear such, in my heart, I'm like, brother, you'll recover. You understand? For me, on a personal level, right? Yeah. Yeah. You'll never find anything. Yeah. But now, once in a while, you must just remind people like Ndamos that you can stand your ground. He went yeah. on your path on your podcast publicly yeah. so which is yeah. about to air probably woman next week and he said a45 s3 rs7 m4 c63 are repossessed publicly yeah right, right now as you speak i've already shown you guys uh, uh about three of those cars like right now yes i even have the rc1 ownership certificates here you understand just yes. just to you know and it it should be an eye opener to the public out there as to what's actually happening even on youtube people just go there and be like guinea is repossessed the same thing that's literally outside like yeah. outside yeah. like literally outside you know so once in a while you must just remind them so now when you see me quarreling online it's not because yeah. i went online and i started a person yeah Yes. They, they they come and start me and what i what do i do i retaliate i respond back now yes. the, my respond backs are very hard to an extent that in public from a distance i look like i'm the attack yeah for example think... shima no uh, this small boy walivender yeah uh, what deep house literally he just started me yes. i was with marco yes. he just started me he's a fan he's a literally a fan he had yeah. to come with one of his friends to where I am, to my circle. The way he doesn't yeah. even qualify to be closer to me. You understand? Yeah. He's yeah. He just started me. Now, when I respond back in public, I look like now I'm swearing at people or starting people, but they start me. Yes. Now, I, I, I retaliate. I respond back to the same attack you're bringing. Like in Damos, he's saying the cars are repossessed. They're outside. I have the ownership certificates. The cars are outside right now as we speak. Uh, coach. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to ask you another question also with Marco also. Uh, mm -hmm. I, I, um, I don't know much about Marco. I haven't checked you out. But yeah. I, I kind of feel like you're doing the same thing as uh, uh, DJ Coach. And you have maybe... Well, courses. I'm going to be I'm gonna be honest. So yeah. as much as I'm a Forex trader, yeah. I'm a lot deeper so i'm i'm more a business person so like i shouldn't be showing this on a live yeah but since 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 it's a decent live and i believe that you know i can show other things that i do so yeah i'm also into many different things now i'm going into the dark because i'm going into my room but if i open up like my safe over here um just to give you an understanding of some of the stuff yeah i love, I I love, I love you man. I'm, I'm I, like I did even a podcast just so that I can learn. Most of the people who think I'm doing it for them, but it's just for me, honestly. And no offense, you know, I want to learn from people. You know, I don't just want to believe and everything that people. While, while Marco is still working, let me just add on to that. And uh, no chill. There is yeah. no way. There is uh, uh, McG's podcast. There is Penwell. There is other podcast, right? There is yeah. no way yeah. where now nah, you can literally have your own podcast do good and still have time to discuss other people's podcast on your podcast exactly so obviously I, I can't do that. yeah nah I'm saying you'll be able to see what's inside here yeah let's see don't, don't tell me it's diamond my nigga that does it does it look like diamonds ah this 
guys is is throwing on some some stones my bro, nigga like some mental this is a lot that's like hey hey bro what are you showing us maybe say, say it the muscle says it's not real <laughs> i know this one i even have a certificate so you, he's crazy you, you own some some like some stones okay sham eh. Eh. Right. so how much how much is like one one uh they call it what kind of baby tongue stone eh? how much is so one it's a carrot so yeah how so many so each carrot here yeah, is, is 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 a ww2s cut right the color on each okay. stone yeah okay the bigger ones here are g cut and the smaller ones are h cut okay explain to us we have no idea what you're talking about okay so basically so basically what happens is so when you buy when you buy a um a stone right a rock let's say so i get i get my stones um i get my stones directly from uh congo the drc okay. right so what happens is right you might get a rock so you, we call it a rock right um we might get a rock that's sitting within let say a a, a a a a space such as a um let's say roughly 400 gram mm. right yeah. um i don't do vv i, I don't do uh, i do vvs2 and vvs1 stones i can get mm. i can get if which is very clean but very expensive and then if nobody's going to get it's just rare very rare to find anyway so here uh, right if you look at a stone so if you look at a stone like this it's basically showing you how clean the stone is so when you look at a stone like this right this here is is is, is roughly about 3.8 carats so we're looking at about we're looking at about three three point two million for this stone alone so uh, selling it off oh. right okay. but this stone so i can, I can marco Let's yeah. say if I have two million, I can buy that stone from from you and then put it on a ring and then propose to my girlfriend. That's hundred percent. Is it the same thing that they do? Hundred percent. It's a stone. So basically, what you okay. do is you'll go to a diamond jeweler or a jeweler in general, and uh, you can just tell them, "Listen, I want to put this stone." Right. Okay. So this this one here, I've got a certificate. This one here is a one point six zero seven carrot stone and um yeah but, but nevertheless what i was saying is what i what, for me i don't just trade anymore it's, it, i can't just have one source of income i have to have multiple sources of income so i only i don't only do this either i also now uh do transportation of um gasoline petroleum you understand so now i'm also into the logistics business you understand yeah. because yeah. i feel like i feel like you've now got this 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 upper hand right so you've got all this money right you've got all this money that you're using um and 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 you're just basically making this money but at the end of the day you are also not putting anything away or you're not really doing anything with the money to make more money from the money you've just made mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. you get me so so at the end of the day at the end of the day um i feel like for me it's been a situation where okay i've made all this money all this money's been generated but i'm not really doing anything i'm not really seeing you know the returns that i could be seeing in regards to figures so now i decided listen in order to make money you've got to spend money and mm -hmm. I've, i've been going at this the whole time you understand yeah. wherever there's money if, if 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 it takes me to be an investment or an investor into a business or into a project yeah. or into a concept i'm there i'm there as long as the returns but seem and sound right to me yes. if the numbers are right i'm gonna get in i'm gonna get involved i'm going to invest you get me yeah. so yeah. with the diamonds with the diamond industry it's it's as as much as people will say it's dangerous it's it's really not you see as long as you're not stepping on anybody's toes besides people who try to steal the diamonds sure right but um for 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 those who are like okay no it's a dangerous industry it's only a dangerous industry when you're stepping on people's toes but if you've got your own 
your own bias and you're not stepping on anybody's toes and you haven't taken them from anybody else, right? Then you're safe. And you only need, you must remember in most cases, you only need, you only need two, three um, buyers. You understand? Because you must remember that you must remember that most of the time, most of the time you'll find out that your buyer will say, listen, everything you get, I want. Now, you must remember that your buyers in regards to money are moneyed. You understand? They money. They're going to send you. I've got guys from Mozambique. I've got guys from Kenya. I've got guys around Africa that are my that are my buyers that are moneyed, seriously moneyed. So when you start meeting these people, right, they start now allowing you to meet their circle in which they entertain in regards to business. And then you get more and more involved, right? And then you find out that now you've got two, three, four buyers, right? And they're all willing to share because someone will actually tell you, listen, I'm looking for a, a, um, a VS2 diamond, right? The other one might, might only be able to afford a double VS1 diamond. The other one might only be aff afford an IF. Uh, you you understand so so it all comes down to again a, a, a diamond could be colored at 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 g h um a diamond could just be colored at g it depends on the specific requirement that the buyer then needs so all buyers are not going to be like oh, okay we all want vs2s no you understand yeah. i could have a buyer in the us that just just wants vvs ones only and i'm going to have to say supply that individual with what okay. they required and requested of me yeah. so i feel like people who say no the diamond industry is dangerous it's only dangerous when you're stepping on people's toes and, and these people who are saying the hawks recorded whatever i have a certificate for these right these are gia approved so <laughs> it doesn't really bother me what, 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 whether they record it and whatever not. And plus, these stones will probably be gone by tomorrow morning, if not um, maybe in the afternoon, right? Because um, these, came in to, they, these came in yesterday. Um, my buyer is in uh, Kenya, but he's flying down here tomorrow morning. His name's Shezi. He's flying down here tomorrow morning, and he's taking the stones. It's as simple as that. They're going to fly in. They're going to pay you. They're going to leave. When you have more stock, you call them. If the buyer is interested, he's going to pay you and he's going to leave. It's just the way the business works. So when people say, oh my gosh, no, it's dangerous. It's dangerous when you don't know what the fuck you're doing. And most people don't. You see, a lot of people get into an industry not knowing. And it's the same as trading. A person will get into an industry not knowing what the fuck they're doing. And they'll come and they'll be like, oh yeah, I made, I made 200,000 today. And then tomorrow, You've lost double what you made. So, did you really make the two hundred thousand, or did you lose four hundred thousand? And in regards to that, you actually lost yeah. four hundred thousand because you had two hundred thousand. Let's say you took two hundred thousand to make two hundred thousand. You've made you've made two hundred thousand. You've got four hundred thousand. You then lose two hundred thousand. What have you really made? You understand? But, but those consequences come into play when you don't know what the fuck you're doing. Okay. You get me. Makes sense. So, yeah. when if I if like like let's say I got into let's say right now I was like okay cool I'm going to start selling cars over the borders I'll make an example I don't even know where to start mm -hmm. right mm -hmm. I don't even know where to start and if I'm going to venture into such a field I need to have some kind of knowledge you you understand going forward now diamonds and the game is really easy you don't really need the knowledge you just need the communication skills you need to get the diamonds and you need to have reliable buyers okay you get me yeah. reliable cool. buyers cool. Where uh, Marco, is, yeah? so, so i i feel like that was actually informative in terms of the diamond but i we, i'm interested in forex but i don't understand the forex you know mm. i feel like that's different industries you know um Okay, uh, what, is it, what, Maybe not what is it? Okay. What is it that you wanna? Okay, what is it that you would like to know about forex in regards to the industry in general? Yes. 
Thank you. Mm. And I'm glad that you asked that question because I'm just here and I'm sure even others are here because you guys are forex traders. That's why there's so many numbers. They're not really interested in a lot of things, but they just don't understand how you're making your money using forex, right? Mm. And I know okay. there's so many things that you guys do, but there are stigmas that are also in forex. So I want you guys to talk about these stigmas. Uh, the, is it legit? Like, what is happening? Why are people hating? Why do you guys go around telling each other that that one is a scam? That is it? It's always going to be. That's how you guys do like yourself. Uh, mm. No chill. There's always going to be haters. Be, 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 I've said this be before. Specific. No chill. I've said this before. Be, be, There's always be going to be haters. Always. Be, so specific. Who goes around telling what they are scammers? Who? Who said what? About bro, another bro, one. Even there are YouTubers who just go Ndamus, like they are talking about DJ Coach this, uh, Marco this, and D Ndamus this, and this, and this. Is, is it Who's saying those to... things? Who's bro, saying many, those things? Many people, many people. I who feel are, like it's a stigma. Those I'm people, sure you bring them here. I get we are here. I want them to say it in our face. Who are those people? You must understand, you must understand one thing. You must understand one thing. Regardless of the industry we're getting into regardless of the field you're going to venture into you're going always going to have that one person who talks bad about the next individual why because you must remember that there's insecurities as an individual you understand yeah. you feel you feel you, you feel undermined you understand so when this takes place right your mindset automatically needs to develop a sense of understanding in regards to making you feel better mindset wise yeah. so what you do right is you make other people right in your industry in your circle in your field or whatever the case is right feel rather shitty about themselves just so you can feel a little better about yourself as the individual yeah. so you bring them down because it somehow brings you up Bro, I, I need to talk to you guys on my podcast, both of you guys. I, I feel like I have so many questions I want to ask for me, you know, for me. And regardless of what people are thinking, I have, I have a lot of questions. I would like to be a forex trader. I want to do it, you know, because I, I think I can afford to get into the market. But it's just, it's just too many information. So I believe you guys can help me somehow and also other people at the same time yeah. no 100% but yeah. you, you you must remember you must remember that most people want to get into this industry because they feel like it's a get rich quick overnight exactly. scheme and it's really not exactly. that is That's when you I lose want. money yeah. and that is when in in any business greed once greed overcomes and overpowers your ability to understanding you will lose money regardless of the business when greed overpowers your understanding in that business yeah. field you will lose money within that business and any other business you get into greed is one of those things that will continue to just bring you down you might think oh my gosh i'm i've got power uh, you get more and more greedy and yeah. sooner or later the greed then brings you down you don't see it coming you don't see it coming because it's too late but when you're too greedy, right? Yeah. The greed overpowers your mindset. Now you think that you know you're the future. You start turning um, heads and uh, start looking at people differently. People start feeling undermined. People start feeling intimidated. Next thing, greed gets you killed. Yeah. Nah. Understand? Greed. So you're saying people yes. are making noise are the people that don't really know the game. No, but you see, that's the thing. Majority, and I'm going to be real here. Majority don't know the game. Yeah. Let's be honest. I've challenged majority. And all they can do is come at you and be on, yeah, uh, why, why do you need to prove a point? But you're at me trying to prove a point, trying to bring me down. What, am I supposed to just let it slide and be like, oh, yeah, no problem. You know, yeah. do your thing. You know, spit all over me, stamp all over me, trample over me, right? Yeah. Throw me into the dirt and let the next person do the same thing? Of course not. Of course not. And I've got your, to industry, point, your, uh, your industry forex trading is like intense, bro. No, nah, it's not. It's intense. It's not. It's not intense. Do you know why? Because yeah. 
some of us only entertain such at our spare time. The reason why I'm live now is because it's my spare time. Yeah. They talk chilly. every day. So that is the difference. I will never stop doing what I need to do uh, just to come entertaining the most or whoever says what. I do it on my spare time. And I, it's for it's entertainment. When the life ends, I go back to my life and I forget that I was ever talking about mm -hmm. this. So, oh, okay, it, it, cool. It, and I'm, listen, sorry to disturb mm. you. And I'm glad that you said that. Most of you guys, because that's what Namu says. He's saying, I'm not like that in real life. I'm just being, I'm giving people what they want. Mm. Yeah, yeah. So, Namu is he's known for just saying whatever. And I think that's a brand that works for him. Yes. Yeah. So, he's going to do that. So, and and yeah. if you post, pictures of houses and cars that's you you're gonna keep doing that Is exactly that and you must you must you must remember the most important thing uh, most important thing that we need to address uh, people have what we call entitlement over success successful people's lives right i'm gonna give an example yeah. of the entitlement that i'm referring to yeah. um people always want to dictate what you should say what you should not say right yeah. and Giving an example with me, I was what we call a feleb. You remember that era I'm a yeah. feleb on Facebook? Facebook yeah, yeah. I've, I've had likes and whatnot around 2013 or so, right? So what I'm trying to say is ever since then, I've been a social media person because I love technology. Yes. I've been posting, right? And from the moment I had Facebook from like 2010 or whatsoever, 2012, I don't remember, I've been doing what we call posting my reality right yeah. and my reality was i was never gonna post a geogon or an rs7 if i did not have it that is why you cannot find it on my timeline yeah. now as i'm working progress as i'm moving i'm posting my current reality now people feel entitled that when we are posting our reality therefore we are breaking to them i don't know what's so special about you that i need to impress you i mean yes. whether you know or not whether i have what i say i have what will change in my bank tomorrow yeah what will improve you understand what i mean yeah. so poor people are so entitled to an extent that they think what we are doing is about them i've been yeah. doing what i'm doing now you oh, see you when i pull yes i'm yeah. speaking about me i yeah. posted a picture today chilling with a jeep srt i have a picture back in the past chilling in a shack yeah. i have a picture chilling next to the tree because there was nothing that i could yes. post it was my reality so now i've worked hard and i'm posting my reality now what i don't like is the entitlement that people think when i post a picture next to my car therefore i'm trying to break to them who are who the fuck are you what do mm. like grain it's my reality you understand what i mean yes so poor people are not just poor got a bank account even mentally mentality their mentality in jay mindset they are poor from bank balance to mindset. To an extent, Tahore, they think whatever that you are doing is about them. It's about mm. me. Yeah. Not you. I didn't come on earth. I came on earth without my permission. Therefore, yeah. even when I die, I will not know that I'm dead. You understand? Mm. Yeah. I'm making sure that every moment that I'm able to live my life yeah. the best way I know how, I'm going to do so. Fuck what they say. You understand? So now, now, what I just don't like about people who speak of our industry, they think that when we are doing the posting, it's about them. It's about them. You are them. not that special. You are hey. not that special. Whether you come into my life or not, I've made money before you. 2017, mm. nobody knew me. I've been posting. 2016, I've been posting. 18, yeah. I've been posting and I'm still going to post. So when you think I'm posting because I'm trying to impress you, you can unlike and block me. And then we will see tomorrow if I'll still not drive the RS7. Yeah. We'll see tomorrow if I'll still not live where I live. We'll see tomorrow if I will still not make money on the market like I do. You understand? So it's, it's black people who are poor who are speaking about our industry more than we do. In mm. the foreign exchange industry, we have a few. It's actually one trader that is the most that talks about everyone. Literally. Can I just, can I just, butt, can I butt in there quickly? Yeah. So, what I've realized, what I've realized as an individual that's been in multiple fields of workmanship and multiple fields um, in regards to um, 
just ventures and 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 get Getting, 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 getting my fingers burnt. What I've realized is it all comes down to the mindset. When you've got a poor mindset, and I want everybody to understand this, when you've got a poor mindset, no matter what you do, right, the the reality and the outcome will always be poor. It will be negative, always. It will always be negative. So when you have this negativity to you, it is stuck with you. It's almost like a curse. Yeah. You understand? It's almost like a curse that's going to stay with you until you yeah. yourself, as the individual, decide to better it. But if you're not going to better yourself, right? If you're not going to better yourself, then you are going to continue to hate and people are going, going to continue to react to your hateness, right? And they're going to then bring forward hate and the energy is just going to get worse and worse and worse. It's almost like they're throwing a curse and the curse is just getting stronger and stronger and it's holding you down for longer and a longer and a longer period. Sooner or later, you won't be able to get rid of that curse. It is going to be a mindset that is stuck with you until forever. Yeah, let me, me just add on that. Uh, no chill uh, on what uh, Marco said about mindset and negativity. Yeah. Right? I'm yeah. going to give you a practical example. Go on YouTube right now. No chill, right? Yeah. And you search DJ Coach. You're going to find DJ Coach exposed. RS7 repossessed. What, what, renting. What, 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 what. You, that's what you're going to find. Ne? Yeah. And I've created companies as it stands right now. Mm. Right now, I've hired over 65 people, and it's not a secret. Yeah. You'll never even find one single video that says DJ Coach is hiring people. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Negativity I think, makes I can, noise. I can give you 100,000 if you find that one video. You will never. You understand? And that, should, that, that already shows you mm. how poor people think. Yes. You know, you can, I, I give e wallets almost every day if I'm able to on WhatsApp. This month only on WhatsApp, I gave away already, I think about 13,000 already. And I'm going to be, be giving uh, uh, 10,000 before the end of the month. Count that, it's going to be about 23,000. Almost a minimum of 20,000 every month on WhatsApp. Nobody will do a video about that, saying DJ Coach is giving back to the community. But that's okay. On Facebook, mm -hmm. I do first to comment. Instagram, I do first to comment. I give people money when I'm able to. You'll never even find a video saying DJ Coach is giving people money. No, but what that's a thing. What you'll find is mm. RS7 repossessed, DJ Coach, this mm. and that. You know, that's that, what, I, I mean, I lost respect for all the broadcasters and YouTubers when I've realized that there's nothing positive that they want. When you do donation, they don't care. They don't want that. Yeah. They, they don't want where that's you a, help. Yeah. yeah. I was going to say, that's the thing. Everybody sees, you see, what I've realized in this industry is the minute you make one mistake, they will remember that mistake until kingdom come. But the good that you've done in the industry, they will not remember. Do you understand? Never. They will not remember. Never. And again, and again, it's a mindset. It's a failing mindset. Do you understand? It's a failing mindset when you are possessed with a mindset that only generates negativity and remembers that as an outcome. Right. When you don't remember the positive things that this industry has brought forward. Right. It is once again a mindset. And the thing is that people don't understand how how deep it gets, because sooner or later, sooner or later, this mindset starts to overpower your own thinking, your own acknowledgement. acknowledgement over you as an individual, who you are, you know, what you stand for. It all gets overpowered. You understand? And people start to see that. And then when people start to see that, right, nobody wants to be around that type of energy and people move away from you. And that's when you realize that, you know what, wait a minute, I'm starting to lose friends. And then you're like, yeah. oh no, maybe God's, maybe God's taking these people away from me. No, 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 no. God was bringing you a blessing, right? That is now turned into a curse because you don't want to change how you think. You get me? You don't want to change how you think and your understanding going forward, right, is going to be a burden on your shoulder. And that's what people don't want to understand. People never want to understand that, listen, the energy you're giving out is the energy you're going to receive and continue to receive. You understand? And I used to be like that. Honestly speaking, I used to be very negative and, um, you know, very, how can I say this? Um, like, 
judgmental, if you want to call it that, you understand? And, and this was me being new to the industry and being forceful to a situation where people just came at me and I had, I had to retaliate, right? But now I've learned to, to keep it back and, 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 and kind of like turn the negativity in regards to energy into a positive energy and give that back, mm. you understand? Because we can, all, we can all go at someone, we can all go at individuals and, 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 and try to tarnish them and their reputations, right? But how about you take that, right? You take that and you do better. So you go on and you're like, listen, so this person came at me, but I just wanna say, listen, um, you know, this person has no hold on me. Whatever this person wants to say, you know, you wanna, you wanna give a positive energy back, right? Because what, what that does, right, it reflects and gives the next person an understanding of the positivity in regards to energy in who you are as an individual. And that makes the person like you more, want to be around you more, want to be around your energy more. It makes them want you to express your energy a lot more. You understand? Yeah. But, and and, but, and but, I've, hmm. got, I've got a confession, no chill. Uh, I, I have a confession. So back in 2012, 13, let me say up until 15, I used to hate a lot of celebrities. And when I say hate, I mean hate. Yeah. Uh, I think I remember so easy just to name a few on my list. So Why? Why? What? I'm going to explain. Uh, I get it. Some yeah. things you only see when you're outside. Yes, so, yes. So I used to, let, let me say, when I see him on TV or any other celebrity, for that matter, I used to say things like, I, oh, Ratadil, what the poor mm. are, you think is better than us. Do you understand what I mean? I, I just used to have a lot of hate. Yes. But as soon as I, I, I made money, I've realized that that wasn't who I was. It was poverty. Yes. That's what poverty does. We can bet right now, Petrus Mutsepa doesn't know I exist. He doesn't know Marco exists. Elon Musk doesn't know we exist. Do you know why? He doesn't care. Every Dick and Harry or Tom and Harry, Dick, whatever, how they put it, who's poor, knows we exist. You see, there's a thin line. So I used to be like them. So now I, I, I sort of, sometimes because now it's me who's being hated, I don't understand why. But at the same time, when I remember how I was, mm -hmm. every time mm -hmm. I, I wasn't posting on social media, but uh, I just had the mentality that I, I don't like this person, including... Uh, there's a brother of mine, DJ 40, mm. like when house music was still, you know. Yeah. Also, 40 is my friend now, but back in the days, I used to think, all right, 40 thinks he's better. Yeah. Thinks, but, well, I, just, I just used to hate. Yes. I regularly call I would just hate and get angry. Yes. But it wasn't me. It was yes. poverty. That's what poverty does to you. So all these people... If one of these haters, I want my biggest hater, if they win Lotto tomorrow, they will start loving me. No, we but will, will Mark Zuckerberg hate you, coach? No. Never! What? He doesn't even <laughs> know you. He won't even care. He doesn't even know I exist. You're making so I'm sense. Understand. I'm understanding yeah. what you're saying. You must understand. You must understand one thing. When you make, when you, when you make an individual relevant, right? When this relevancy being brought forward to an individual. And he, he sees that he feels entitled to that. Because why? You're giving it to him on a, on, on a silver platter. Why shouldn't I feel entitled to it? I should feel entitled to it. You're giving it to me. Yeah. You understand? And that yeah. goes for anything in regards to energy. You understand? You bring in the, if you bring in the same energy, right? That's how we're going to take it when you bring that energy. We're going to feel entitled to that energy. And we're going to use that energy the way we want to use it. And we're going to abuse that energy the way we want to abuse it. You get me? Yeah. So yeah. a lot of people don't understand that, right? And as you grow in money, as you grow in um, just understanding figures and understanding that, you know, money can come from multiple sources, right? There can be multiple sources of income that brings in money. But what was that? That one thing that generated that mindset <laughs> it was the forex industry. Yeah. It was the fact that I was able to save money. You understand? Yeah. Put money away and use that to build a foundation that could then bring up, you understand, 
could then bring up a generation where I can be like, okay, fine. I now want to generate this much money into there, this much money. Into, but there needed to be something that generates that kind yeah. of source in order to fund mm. other um, adventures or other projects going forward. You get me? But yeah. a lot of people don't want to do that. What, 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 people want to people want to Live, people want to live for today. I make a million rand today, I buy a car tomorrow. Yeah. Fucking stupid mentality. You get me? It's a fucking yeah. stupid mentality, and that is where people are sitting right now. Yeah. You understand? Where, yeah. Because Marco has six cars, Marco has an M8, Marco's showing him driving this, Mark, we want to be there. But you don't understand, you don't understand what I've been through in order to get the cars that I drive. What I've been through to live in this beautiful penthouse. What I've been through, you understand, to do what I do and spend money on what it is that I'm spending money on in regards to generate more income. People don't understand that. People think that, oh, okay, this guy just woke up one day and was a multi-billionaire yeah. or a multi-millionaire. Yeah. No, no, that was not the fucking case, unfortunately. We all worked and worked our asses more because people are like, oh no, this person, sorry, this person yeah. um, is selling mentorship or this person is selling signals. And what I've shown, what I've shown is the fact, and I've shown it multiple times, that the mentorship and the cost of signals comes nowhere close to the figures that I make for that month. And people don't understand, they're like, well, how is this person making four and a half million rand in 20 days? Where? And they don't understand that I've taken what I've, what, what I've built to make more money. You understand? Marco, uh, Marco, 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 let me ask you a question. Eh? Okay. Yeah, uh, I'll ask, I'll, I'll uh, Marco, let me ask you a question. question. Yeah. Uh, if, 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 if you are not known, you as a person, if you are not known as a trader, if you don't have money, is there any person who's going to come and pay for lessons? Yes or no? So, Yes and no. Now let me explain. Hold on. Let me explain. Now let me explain. Let me explain. Yes and no. Like now I have a lot of Yes and no. 100%. Yes and no. Yes. Yes. In regards to the fact that they see this lifestyle, they want this lifestyle. They've been in a situation that you've been in. They've been in the poverty industry. Um, or rather in the, in the poverty uh, situation, they've been at rock bottom where I've been, you understand? So I know what it takes and the hunger one would actually want to gain in order to get out of that situation. So I understand that, right? And that's towards the lifestyle. Then there's towards the workload. You understand? Because you as coach can give the lifestyle, Marco can give the workload, but what? is going to benefit you the most your lifestyle or the workload mm -hmm. that will answer both so of your that, questions yeah the, the reason why i asked that question uh i have a problem with outsiders mentality outsiders i'm referring to people who are not in the forex uh, space yes yeah. ne? like uh, for example yeah for yeah correct mm. for example uh i have one guy i just bought a gti uh, just about last week, right? And I've, I've shown the trades. I think I've posted it on my stories, how I made the money to buy the GTI. Mm. It was about 300 and... I actually spent, I think, 330 something thousand for it. I've made it on a trade, right? I've posted the trade as well. My, my chat and my problem is people feel so entitled that one guy who uh, paid me 90 rents for one minute strategy literally said to me that I bought that car with his 90 rents. So, but you see, that's just that now, who can, how, what, like, who's going to even entertain that? Well, okay, but anyway, yeah. So now, my problem now is people want to take away the credit, the fact that you are able to trade and make money. And they want to make it all about themselves in, an, in, a, in a sense that for you to say, coach, teach me how to trade is because you, you, you have seen yeah. me buy that R7. Before you, you were not there. I was able to trade and I was able to buy it. Now, when you come to me, you pay that 90 rand or whatever the case it may be, all of a sudden now you feel entitled. That is why I'm saying outsiders because they feel so entitled that 
we are buying the things that we have using their money where else they came to us because we have those things those niggas are gold diggers when you don't have anything when you don't have anything yeah, nobody will say teach me how to trade if i had to show yeah. and, and I, i've done it many times but if i had to show my net worth right now nobody in this industry would be able to say listen you got that money from forex or you got that money from mentorship or signals something has to give the 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 figures are way too high and large and big to say, listen, this guy got this money from, from mentorship or signals. When you are, and I tell this, and, 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 and this is no joke, when you are a quarter of a billion A, you are on that edge of being a quarter of a billion A, right? You can't tell me me listen you use my signals money or you used my <laughs> mentorships money your mentorships and me. signals money is a drop the in the fucking ocean for me you get me yeah. so a lot of people did you see a lot of people want to understand listen how did you get to this point in your life but nobody wants to understand the journey going forward and what it took so people want to want to just expect that listen this person did one two three or this person did one two three or this person did one two three to get to where they yeah, are currently in life and it, it's it's it, it, that's not the situation yeah. you understand that's not the yeah. situation because if i had to show right if i had to show my net worth going forward what i have versus what i owe right if i had to go into my banking app right now i had to go onto the tv and literally log in to my fmb account right which i can do and show my net worth and show my net worth right yeah. people you, you as a person cannot be oh, this guy made it's all of this money from, from, from cities, uh, or this guy made signal, all this exactly. money from from mentorship no 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 you would need millions of people right you would need a rather a, a, a good few, you know, thousands or hundreds of thousands of people to 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 have joined your mentorship. Now, when the figures right are not matching in regards to the figures that are um, basically sitting in a certain account showing a certain amount of figures, right, in regards to money. Now, um, when when the figures that are being brought forward in regards to mentorship versus the figures that are being brought forward in regards to actual capital sitting in your account when 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 it doesn't make sense it's exactly that it doesn't make sense the sense does is not there because the figures do not make sense and why don't the figures make sense because something's got to give and we need to understand that something's got to give yes at first you know the money might have been coming in from the mentorship yes at first the money might have been coming in from signals right but we all better ourselves you understand we all better ourselves and we all want to obviously you know sooner or later become a person that people look up to and i'm at that point where people look up to me and, I, and i'm at that point where my mentorship now i hardly even um attend the meetings you get me because yeah. i'm at that i'm at that stage where i have got my soldiers right or rather the people that i've taught how to trade teaching people how to trade yeah. and the fact of the matter and the fact of the matter is that obviously the the the, the bringing forward of 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 of, of, of um, students that can actually show their results and yeah, results so being like, positive marketing now yeah, hundred percent. Will then will then obviously show that listen, this person doesn't need to show the lifestyle, right? Because he's now gotten to a point where his work speaks for himself. Yeah, you can ask another question. Yes, you? please, guys. Oh, I uh, thank you so much for the opportunity, guys. Like, I really appreciate it. <laughs> I mean, I've been actually listening, and Marco, for you, I would like to acknowledge. I've actually. When I was listening, I'm very, I'm a very good listener. Mm -hmm. What I've actually learned from you, I know that based on what you've been saying, you're more of a spiritual being. You actually believe in personal development. You know more of the things, mental results, everything that you bring up about to happen is a manifestation of your mentality, and I love yes. it. 
and i'll also like to invite you to my podcast if you like you know even dj coach is gonna come hopefully next week coach yeah for part because i have a lot of questions for you guys you know i want to learn like i said you know but i have this one question uh this is based on forex trading okay do you guys yeah. feel like there's a need for you to show off is, is, is it part of it no okay is there no. any is there any forex trader who's trading and is winning and they're not showing up a lot i'm, I'm sure i'm a sure lot. i'm sure there's a lot a lot let, let me answer first on that one yeah. i want you to refer to refresh your statement say it again uh, is there any forex trader who's trading out there and making millions and, and no, no, millions no. and we don't the know about part, them not, not that one the first part the show off part yeah, I, yeah I, like I, showing I, off like okay is it part of the marketing for you guys to come and say i have this car i have this wow. house I, show off. I, like now, i live here I, this is my yeah, lifestyle po post it right there post it right there uh, now i'm saying to you that i have two million in my bank account yes uh i'm posting right what do you take that as is it a show off or what is it is it marketing for them uh, people I want to come to you, you answer me yeah. is it a show off like i want you to honestly answer me as an outsider it i'm showing you two million is it a show off yes or no I, I, was, I was to be honest according to me i would think is like you showing up yeah for me yeah thank you let's let's post it right there okay sure four years down the line i've posted the same bank account yeah capitec which had 37 rent is it yeah. show off yes or no no that's like actually ah. just showing your life ah. out to the world let's post it right there yeah five years ago five years ago I've made a post yagore yo eh uh, my dream car is a Toyota Tez is it a show or show off no. yes or no you're just sharing your story and what you thank want. you yeah i feel you last yeah. week I, I i said i'm going to buy a gti and i did yeah. and i posted it yeah. and i said I, i'm going to buy an, a second srt and i posted it is it a show off yes or no but but the me is the motive i understand yeah. you coach so, I, will, I will still get to the no, I'll, I'll, I'll get to the motive why do you I'll feel get to the motive I, 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 why don't you just say yes or no oh, i'll get to the motive okay sure I, I, okay well you just do you i'll get yeah, that sharp. you now sure. yeah last week or two a month ago i'm saying that uh i'm, I'm listening to a taxi driver saying yo I need to change tires for my quantum in a public space. I need to change tires for my taxi. Yeah. Uh, nobody said anything. Uh, people just continued doing whatever that they're doing. Yeah. And I came in and I said the same statement and I said, yo, I need to change tires for my RS7. What is the difference between these two statements? Uh, the taxi driver did mention I need to change tires for my taxi, Quantum, Toyota. Nobody said anything. And I came and I said the same statement. Mm -hmm. And I said, I want to change uh, tires for my RS7. What is the difference between these two statements? We literally said the same thing. The first statement, people didn't react. They are now reacting to my statement, saying yeah. I'm breaking. What is the difference between these two statements? Yeah. Mm. I want you to answer me the question. I'm, I'll still get to the no, motive. No, I understand your question, but I'm asking mm. based on the forex trading part. Taxi driver, you understand? Okay. But I feel like with yeah. forex traders, yeah, there's always one. You always want to put something to. Sh I don't know if it's how it is. Is the, your marketing yeah. or what? I don't yeah. know. I'm now, asking because I want to understand. Yeah, no, I, I get what you What mean. I'm about to show you is that so, a show of. So, so <laughs> now, so now, back to my examples, no chill now. Yeah. Uh, the taxi driver said he wants to change tires for his taxi. Nobody said anything. And I, I said I want to change tires for my RS7. All of a sudden, it's show off. Do you know what the real problem is mm. there? Yeah. Poor, and I have already spoken about it. Mentality. Meh. When I say 
when you now, when you, you say that you have seen uh, you, you are driving a Suzuki or you are advertising it, which is a good, which oh, is yeah. a good thing. You're sure. working with the brand. Yeah. When you say now, yo, I need to take my Suzuki to the car wash uh, and you post it on social media, we are not even going to entertain you. But if Elon Musk says, I need to take my private jet to the private jet wash, all of a sudden it becomes an issue. Mm. I'm still going to go back to the main thing. What is the real problem here? Remember, no chill. If you want to solve a problem, you can't go to the end of the tunnel. You must start from the beginning. When you are saying what is the motive behind us saying that, you are very far. Let's start from the beginning. Two situations of a quantum and R7. One yeah, is it's, normal, it's, it's one the is perspective. Do you understand perspective. what I mean? I so think. now, another one, another one. I'm saying that, yo, I need to paint my house inside a what, 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 what estate. Then Sibanibani says, yo, I need to paint my RDP Koranku. On social media, people are not going to entertain the RDP one. But me, who said I'm going to paint my house in an estate all of a sudden. So I'm giving you different examples that the problem is, is, is not who's saying it. The problem is it's, it's deeper than okay. what we think. Now. Tality. If, if, everywhere, no. everywhere, I'm about to finish. Everywhere where there's poverty, people are okay with it. Once you speak a language that they don't afford and understand, it's breaking. Now, the biggest question is, what is the difference between a quantum driver who's saying I'm going to change uh, tires for my quantum and me who's saying I'm going to change tires for my RS7? Why am I regarded as breaking? Why when I was posting my 37 rent Capitec bank balance, it's there on my Facebook account. Nobody said anything, no chill. Now when I'm posting 2 million, now I'm breaking. Yeah. I want you to understand, you, you see, it's deeper than what we think. Mm. And it's even be yeah. beyond that. If we make it about Forex, then it's stereotype somehow. We just need to make it about black people in general. Now, if, if you are going, uh, you post and you say you have graduated from uh, Sibanyoni College, nobody's going to say anything. But once you say you have graduated from VET, yeah. it's a problem. Yeah. Hey. If you now say you have graduated from uh, Nsatole College, but now you say, no, I've graduated from Harvard, all of a sudden you are breaking. Hey. Yeah, now I feel it. than what we think. I feel it. Now, now, when I speak, my leader, I don't speak for other people. Yeah. Everything that I'm showing you today, it's what I've been showing people before, even when I was poor. The only difference is nobody fucking cares when you have any when you don't have money, my nigga. <laughs> but I can see Marco is about to shut down the internet right now. I want you, I'm gonna ask you this question after. If I log into my FNB right now and I show you 20 rents, is it show off? If Marco logs into his FNB and he shows you 100 million, is it show off? You, you <laughs> just you that's, that's actually a nice one. That's actually a nice one. So it's the Mindset. perspective. It's what, yeah, we're not, what we're not no on this life. Nobody would care. But if Marco says, yo, let me go to the drive through car my Mustang, all of a sudden yeah. Marco is begging. When it's okay for them for you to say Suzuki, but Marco can say Mustang. Why? Why are we living? Nah. Are we living to impress Trust people me. or are we living for our reality? It's my reality. If I have two Milan, I'm gonna post it the same way I've posted that 37 range. So if when you think I'm okay, uh, no chill. Yeah. If now we are saying it's marketing related, ne? Uh, no chill. Uh, no chill. Yo. Uh, when we say if now you are you are saying uh, it's marketing related, when I posted that 37 rand, yeah, keep it tech. Yeah. What was I marketing? I'm gonna ask. You that first There's question. nothing to market. What what, they... what, what, what what was I marketing that I'm now marketing when I post two million? Nah, you just continue being you. I don't think there's any marketing there. Thank you. So now you see from an outside perspective, yeah. it's yeah. within the right to think that I'm bragging. But yeah. if you it's it's deeper than that. But Mark is deep. about to shut it's down deep. the internet. I feel you. I feel you. I'm listening. So, I'm listening so and I'm learning.
you problem, feel I'm problem, my leader, with black people is we are okay to tolerate anything which is related to poverty. Yeah. We are okay. There is no problem. Mara, once you speak a language that black people can't relate to, all of a sudden you think you are better than them. But now, if if that that same person wins lotto tomorrow, yeah. they'll still do the same thing that they were hating you for. Uh, I used yeah, good. to hate people who speak about money, but now I'm one of them. Yes. I've realized that I don't need to hate Marco for whatever that he's doing. I'm it's learning. good for him. It's working Sarah, for him. Shut up. I'm learning, bro. I don't I'm need learning. to hate you for whatever that you're doing. Yeah. So what? I'm learning, what? man. First things first. I don't understand when you first see me posting something nice, mm. why must the first thing that comes to your mind be that I'm marketing? Why must the th first thing be that I'm bragging? Why don't you just start by saying congratulations? Yeah. Before right. you were asking You're me. You're teaching me. You're yeah, teaching me. I don't know about other me. people are watching, mm. but uh, They're learning. not listening to this one. Uh, you'll see I'm them. learning. <laughs> So before you 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 are, you are asking me or why am I breaking why am I advertising why have you ever said congratulations first mm -hmm. things first yeah have you ever asked me dude where do you come from where were you six Ish. years ago people don't care about that this deep. they want to accept you right now and not to give you are running a, a no chill vodcast ne yeah. Before the vodcast, how many things have you tried? So many things, trust me. But now, as a person, I will come and attack that uh, podcast and say, you think you are better than McG. When did <laughs> I say congratulations? When did I ask you, no chill, where did you start? <laughs> did you start on Megxit? You understand? Why must I now start attacking you instead of understanding where you come from? You come There's from. There's a reason why you have a podcast right now. There's a yeah. reason why you are where you are now. Why don't we as black people normalize asking, where do you come from? Instead of saying, why are you bragging? Who said I'm bragging? Coach, when now, are we coming to Northfield Vodcast, bro? Because I feel like this should be documented <laughs> nicely and <laughs> properly marketed. Because, I mean, that's what people need to know. I mean, I can't blame people who actually, like, hate on others. Because it's the lack at of understanding. Marco there. Look at Marco. Look at no, this is nothing. This one, this, this, don't worry. This is just a stupid investment. Yeah, yeah. Just show the show them the stupid investment. <laughs> show them, Marco. <laughs> that's, that's like, that's like, like one, one million six. and a half, bro. It's a stupid invest. Million and a half is a stupid investment. Uh, while so, we're still there, yeah, while we're yeah. still there, yeah. hold on. So, while we're still there, I just want to see if there is nothing. Uh, so I'm trying to get it. You guys inspire me. I won't lie, bro. Like, I'm inspired. I'm not gonna come uh, in line. Act like, yeah, uh, no chill. I'm inspired, yo. Uh, no chill. So, I've, I've, I've shown, I've, I've shown, uh, I get it now, Marco. We're still on the stupid investment level, yeah, and personal experience. I'm trying to find, I'm trying to find my net worth. Hold on, all right. Uh, no chill. Sure. Uh, I've shown a stupid. <laughs> you are strong before. Stupid. Listen. Stupid yes. I want you to understand stupid. and hear me properly. I've shown a stupid bank balance before, of twenty rands, forty rands, hundred rands, yeah. what not. Sure. Now, if now I am doing Uber Eats or I'm um, just buying anything, a computer or anything anywhere. We have what we call petty cash. Yes. It's like cash, like you just, you know, you can just, you just like, do it. Anything yes. with it. Yeah. Yeah. It's, 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 a, it's a small, small transaction. We, as Marco says, yeah. as Marco <laughs> says, it's, it's, it's stupid. Like, it's, 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 it's stupid. Wangusha. So, I told you before, like I told you before. <laughs> Let me see if I can get onto my phone. Eh? Let me see, my phone's got 30%. Let's just see if I can get onto my phone and then get into... Tap, 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 tap,
fucking up like you okay guys i'm inspired like i i'm really really inspired i won't lie to you i'm not gonna pretend uh, I'm, I'm, not, I'm, like, I'm not done i'm not done so, no chill i'm still uh going on to the other phone oh yeah uh, i just wanted to uh, i thought i could show it over here it doesn't want to show me but my network with my, my network will we, show over here so it's fine still, we are we are still on stupid investment now I was so, still on stupid, and and every time before you attack me, remember that I've I've I just wanna let me just hide sensitive information because you know FNB takes out account numbers and stuff, man. Yeah. So let me just yeah. scratch this nah, out. Nah, guys, let me, I know. Yeah, let me I just. Said. So so so. And so by guys, the way, so guys, by the way, guys, okay. by the way, so, guys, iPhone can screenshot anything. Let me about Richard Android. I'll let me see. Let me just screenshot and scratch out uh, <laughs> and, and coach and Marco, Be, before I want to understand I it's still know. on a screenshot mode yeah wait let me finish it's still on us i guess we are still on stupid investment yeah. marco we are we are still together on that one miss yeah because yeah, yeah okay uh, yeah so so we are still together on that one ne? Yo. Are, are you are you looking are you looking i'm here okay thank you where do we i go where do... stupid investment <laughs> And Where do I go we, for my net? We, we 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 are still on stupid investment. Not so that's, just, that's go... like six million. Don't say it out loud. No chill. Ah, you are still it out loud. Get, you we're, it we're still out on loud. stupid investment. Sharp. Are you not Let saying me... it out loud? Don't, don't say <laughs> it out loud. No chill. Don't say it out loud. <laughs> but, but, but no, let no chill cook as well. Hey, but no. <laughs> no, no I'm yeah, let, it. Let, oh, let me let me scratch oh, out life. important information on this one. Let me scratch out. We are still on stupid investment. I'm trying yeah. to go to a network. We are still on investment. Are you are you are you are very low? No chill. Are you ready? So we we are still. Still on stupid investment. I get so you have like different accounts with millions. <laughs> like I get it. Random stupid. Oh, you call them stupid uh, uh, investments? No chill. I can also show you an account that has. Uh, let me see what's the worst that I could find. That has two hundred rents. Mm. Ne? Yes. I'll, let me show you. Wait. I just want to screenshot this because I don't want to take out any uh, sensitive. Yeah, let me just crop this one out because it's like multiple accounts, you see. So let me just show you a, a stupid one. People, that, people, people, people want what, me what to this one. I don't want to be with myself, Kai. When, come on. Come when when you show this, when, the, when you show this one, no one yeah. will ever judge you. When do you show this one? You see this one? Yeah, that, that's you know, my level. You see, you see what? See? This one will beat you because you now, see <laughs> now, now, now it's it's it, it's black people. Yeah. When you show them two hundred and eighty-one rand in an account, they will never say anything. But mm. and that is my reality. But now mm. also. My reality can also go to 6M. My reality can go to 2M, can go to whatever amount. I just don't want to show a lot. If you're not inspired from here, then that's your business. Ne? But that is, that is my reality. To understand and no chill. Mm. Now, instead of you saying I'm breaking, why don't you ask me, where do you come from? How did you get there? Yes. So, so, so the main point is to understand your story. Before you even ask me what am I marketing? What was I marketing with that 37 rent I've posted? Nothing. What am I marketing with 200 rents that I've shown you? Nothing. So why would you think I'm marketing with 6 million? Why would you think I'm marketing with 2 million? Why would you think I'm marketing with whatever that I haven't disclosed? I've been showing You guys the, are the, humiliating the, me. You are humiliating the, me. My, my, my dad, my father gave me a wheelbarrow before. Yeah. And I've posted it. What was I marketing with that wheelbarrow? Now when I'm showing you car ownership certificates, why would you say I'm marketing? What was I marketing? You understand what I mean? I'm trying to when find my staying, network, guys. Yo. When I was staying in a, in a student accommodation, when I was post, posting, what was I marketing? 
Now when I buy a property and I'm posting, what am I marketing? So you must question my before before you question my yes. after. Yes. Hey, that's powerful, bro. <laughs> yeah. No, but it's the same as it's the same as this. It's the same as this account. Uh, Marco, hey, but I don't know if I want. Let's I don't know if I really want to show this account, but it's the same as this account. So here. Yeah. Uh, Marco, Marco, don't humiliate me like that. Okay. Uh, hold on. So coach, wait, hold on. Yeah. Uh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Don't, hold on. Look. I should be saying that, bro. What how much is there? Don't, don't expose how much, account numbers how, and stuff. Just how much is there? How much is there? We can't see as yet. Uh, I see it's, available it's, only. It's we see available only. We see available only. We see fifty cents. <laughs> That's fifty cents. Yeah, we cent, see fifty yeah. cents. 50 cent is what's visible now. Hey, you guys are disrespectful, bro. <laughs> <laughs> now nah, I'll tell you, nah, nah, in front of people. I nah, tomorrow these people must respect us. Joe, ukase, 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 oh, but, but, one minute. Coach, yes, coach, yeah. they never gonna respect you. What about me? That's what I'm saying. Ukase, hey, ukase, you ukase, disrespectful. Ukase. <laughs> ugas <laughs> 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 7,000, we can see 7,000. No one will say anything about 7,000. Uh, we can see 180,000. This is e This is my e bag so it's 80,000. You guys just like have money, like random e amounts, like everywhere, like, hey. Uh, oh, 13 everywhere. million, yeah, hey, no chill. Here you go. Uh, so, Marco, Marco. Marco, hmm. yeah. I, I've already shown, I think, about close to uh, 9 million now with like two different banks. But yeah, so when I have shown 30 million, cut it there, my brother. Don't humiliate me. Look, dog. I want to show, I want to show a net worth. I, no, <laughs> don't show us the net worth. It's fine. Because now, at least when I'm on 9 million and you're on 13, it's, you know, it shows we are friends. Don't go above. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, why am I here? Why am I this, on this live? Okay, I'm just asking. <laughs> you are, you, you are, you are here because, because you appreciate black excellence. And no. I want yeah. everyone to me, know, even if tomorrow they say a felon dog, a felon, yeah. will like, I want to I go, want to know I, want, I, was I want my network. Me, I want, where do we go for a network? I haven't done it here. I've done it on my, I want to show people my network. So you can see that that thirty million is a joke. Uh, uh, I can only see I can only see my net worth on a personal account, not business. So you need to log into the personal that is linked to the business. That's where you can see your net worth. The business doesn't really show. I it think is. last time I checked. Yeah. So you need to go yeah, into just... your personal. So even if your personal doesn't have money, ne, it will show your net worth even across all F and B accounts. Do you understand what I mean? Yeah. All the assets and everything you can find it there. Uh, let me just see something. But don't show us, Mark. We don't want to see half a billion. Or so. we, are, we don't. Marco, you see, there's a difference between depressing people and inspiring people. So don't depress Wait. us, dog. I'm trying to see something. Hold on. Statement history. Don't show us. No, 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 guys. No, guys. Me, me, I'm not, I'm not here yet. Honestly, I won't, I'm not going to lie and try to show my sh stuff. I, I, I'm not there yet. Okay. Yeah. I'm being honest. No, no chill, bro. No chill. Yeah. There's no way sure. you can show stuff now when you have never shown stuff before. I don't you want to see. It's not my life also, hey, bro. So, you, but you, we want to see. I'm being want, honest. I'm not yeah. there. Even if. It's not my staff, <laughs> but I'm not yeah. there yet. Yeah. So we, 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 we want to see your before. Where where is your first 37 run before you had one million? Where where is it? So if you I now don't, come I don't really show don't, money, bro. Don't but... don't be don't be like <laughs> this. You know nowadays there are these traders. 
you just yeah. ca- you can't just come into the industry of Umbuga when all of a sudden you are a billionaire. Yeah. Uh, where else we don't even understand or never seen you trade or seen something that shows us a storyline. Yeah. Uh, no, but man thing. is coming, uh, coach. Man is gonna come, but I don't. I doubt I will even show, bro. Cause it's not my. It's not me. I haven't been showing from the beginning. You feel me? So, yeah. Um, so let, let me just let me just uh, inspire uh, where we actually get the money. And if remember now, if I show FBK markets, everyone will think everything is uh, internal and whatnot yeah i'm gonna yeah. show them something mm-hmm. small just here xness yeah, yeah everyone you can check xness is not my broker they they know yeah i want everyone to confirm on the uh, comment section do yeah. i own xness do i have any association with xness yes or no exactly so i'm about to log in now ne? i'm going to log in so now it's going to take out sensitive information uh so so I'm just going to log in right now, right? I'm, I'm inside my Xness account. Ne? So when I'm inside my Xness account, I'm going to go to a transaction history. I'm going to click the transaction history. Ne? Mm-hmm. And then under transaction history, uh, I will show last 30 days, uh, all transactions. I don't wanna I want to show specific transactions. Sure. I will select withdrawal. Mm-hmm. Withdrawal first. Yeah. So you see, this is withdrawal history. And then uh inside the invoice number more. I don't wanna expose that. We don't, we don't wanna see this Check one the for, date. for you see the date. The date. You see the date. June. It's June. June. I see June. June 2023. When? June 2023. 2023, I Sharp. Sure. I'm just going to move. I don't want to show invoices and whatnot. I'm just going to show the first Arnya, four transactions. Yeah. Arnya, come on and, 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 hey, and I want everyone to help me calculate. The first transaction, Kibugai? 132K. This is, a, this is a withdrawal, by the way. Uh, that is internet banking. Yeah. Uh, yo, shit, I'm showing uh, invoices. Oh, um, one, you can see. Sure. I get, sure. I get people... people are saying we're selling courses and we can't trade so sure. sure. the first transaction and then the second transaction how much are these when you add them this is like close to three something at uh, four close to 4k, uh, 4K. Help us calculate. take out calculators guys take out calculators three six they must be seven are you sure 357 132 plus 225 how much is it yeah it has to be 357 oh uh, these people are hunty. they are just watching their life they are useless they are not even helping us yeah 357,000 sure. so i'm scrolling down ne? no chill sure. uh, i'm scrolling down how much is this 226 add that 226 guys that's like uh how much, how much is this? 560 something, yeah. bro. I, I'm, yeah. I'm not good with math, but yeah. Yeah. Close how to much is the last one? 551. Something you know like I mean? that. Last transaction, give guy. 227. Hey, yeah, bro. I'm not going to be. Yeah. Like, so bro, now, bro. guys, let the people the calculate. Following I'm not going to be calculating. Yeah. This is too I much, know, don't want too these people on this live will add. Sure. Guys, add this the following amount 227, 226, 225, 132. Add and tell me the total the, of the four tra- transactions. The first four. They will tell us the transaction 132, 225, 226, 227. It's all withdrawal. Done. You see, it's done. Done. Yeah. Where? On. Uh, in June. Ex- in June. In on June, this month. Xness, you can see it. Xness, it's not my broker where you can say it's my systems. We're in June 2023. How much is the total, guys? Yeah, they're saying a lot of 563K. It's 810,000. Is it? Oh, yeah. So, so, so now, no chill. Sure. Uh, A person is saying we are selling courses we can't trade. And 
That right. is your broker. So no, Exynos is not my broker. What is it? I don't know this things, coach. I'm not I'm, a forex trader. I'm, I'm but, FBK. Uh, I'm FBK. I'm not X. <laughs> So how, how are you downloading the money? The, how are you just gonna withdraw the money from Exynos? I get it. Downloading the people, money, bro. No chill. People are saying we can't trade. I get. Sure. What I'm doing now is 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 showing them actual withdrawals, and this is my first time. People who follow me know this is my first time in maybe two to three years showing this. People don't really know where I am what I do, and what, I just show them four transactions only for this month. So people are saying we can't trade, then what the fuck is this? A person who can't trade is able to withdraw 810,000, and there's four more transactions that are bigger than this that I haven't shown. Because I can't go to the land. I was just showing them. So a person who can't trade is able to have this. <laughs> So, coach, for you, so, it's more of, okay, you know what, I, I can do this, guys. Like, you try to for me, for, for me, it's more like I've been trading way before you. You, you even knew I exist. And sure. why would now, why would you now come into my life and you pay me nice rent? I probably pay the maintenance guy just to give you the savings. I don't even gain anything out of it. And you have the nerve and the balls to say I'm I I I'm yeah, making the, my money through you. Through you. Yeah. Sure. You understand I what I mean? It. I've been sure. trading before you. So even if that I was trading before you were even born. When I say born, I'm simply I simply mean before your your mentality was even smart enough. I was trading. How much do you make through the courses? I don't, I don't make anything through the courses. I pay. I pay my uh, website uh, team fifty one thousand mm. every month. The IT guys, number one, mm. ne fifty one thousand. Number two, uh, we are using what we call servers, right? So there's what we call uh, those who are doing IT. They'll correct me if I'm wrong. There's what we call Ocean. Ocean. It's a big server. Ever. They call it Ocean Wat Wat. Yeah. Those guys, I'm paying them, I think, about $2,000. Are we ready? Dollars. That is. This is. Oh, yeah. I, this is what. This uh, is. Marco, this is what. Do that. Oh, let this me, this is what we don't get. On, this is what we don't get on the banking app. But just to inspire yeah. everybody. Let's say. Mm. Uh, money. You're inspiring me, not everybody. <laughs> I'm kidding, guys. <laughs> I'm kidding. <laughs> are you, are you, but, are you but, finding it? But I would like to have you guys on Notion sure Vodcast because I feel like... Uh, um, dog, that one, that one is, is done. You know, I've been there on part one, definitely yeah. part two. No, when I, sure. I, I want you to prepare hot questions. When I say bruh, hot questions... Bruh. When I say okay, hot on, questions on, is, is... Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. I don't update the phone. It will take time. Mm -hmm. Bro, I'm, I'm ready, ready me. I'm ready. I'm gonna prepare. I'm not just gonna let you come here, coach. I respect your time, bro. Like, trust me. I'm not like that. Yeah. You no, I, 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 I want. Yeah, oh, on. they call it digital ocean, guys. It's digital ocean. It's a cloud server. <laughs> they're, sure. they, they, they're the biggest in the world, as far as I'm concerned. Wanna see? It. Yeah, Marco. Correct. Yeah, Marco. Marco is still logging in. Uh, I, I just so no, no chill. Now so, I want you to roast me, dog. I want to ask you your coach. Uh, I wanna be real. I'm gonna be real, coach. With yeah, you, and you know that. I'm not yeah. gonna. And I, I want you to talk, tell the truth, bro. And I believe yeah. that you can tell the truth. You feel me? So, I, one I will, thing, one thing I can tell you, no chill, is so, that no one can pay you. Remember now when a person is paying, yeah. you are paying for my time. Now I'm not cheap. Even when sure. you book me for a gig, you are paying for my time. My time is valuable. Sure. If you don't respect your time, that's your okay, problem. Now I'm, sure. I'm and if you don't want to respect my time, then that's your business. Sure. Now, now if, if now, if you don't have 100,000, sure. there is no one who can pay you 1,000. Okay.
I'm in. Here we go. Oh yeah. Navigate. Marco has been waiting for this thing for like an hour, bro. Like, yo. <laughs> Marco, I hope you are, you're gonna find what you're looking for, bro, because you've been there. So bro. money, money in so far. Where is it? But don't mind, don't mind that. Sure. Let's go to that. So you owe four hundred. Who owe you four hundred? I'm being black now. Bank charges. <laughs> I'm being black now. Who Bank are you owing, charges. Marco? <laughs> so you have like two hundred and fifty ten million. Two hundred and what? Collection of all when, the same. When I told, when I told, when I told everybody that I was a quarter of a billion, a eh, it wasn't oh. a joke. So it's Marco, tell me something, ne? Marco, yeah. tell me something. Where were you born? Was it in South Africa or Italy? Italy. Italy. Guys, let us not compare ourselves to this guy. This guy, guy he, he was born rich. <laughs> That's it. He's only 400. <laughs> you know me, me being black, I want to know who's that for? Who are you owing for? Why can't you pay? You have millions, bro. What the fuck? <laughs> I don't know who I, I don't know who was owing. <laughs> I know you wouldn't know. No, but but know. it's 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 I get it. Eh, 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 not chill. Sure. There is there is normal savings account, twenty forty eight yeah. hour cash accelerator. Yeah. There's like yeah. different yeah. account types sure. you can open. So yeah. one of the accounts, including a uh, cash stash, one of the account is on a minus. Mm. So he hasn't loaded money in it. Pay so it's hey, just bro, reflecting it there. So it just needs to transfer either, five million from that main account oh, to that small one. Oh, so that it can, yeah. So. so it's not really that he's owing a person. It's having many accounts. Mm. You can have mm. as many accounts as possible in NF in FNB only when you qualify to. And what so. people people will say people will say that you transfer your money blah blah blah. What I love, some guy came to me and was like, Marco, so he has money in. This man. Right. That's money in, money out, right? But if we go view more, what I always tell people is, yes, yes, fine. I've spent four seventy seven, but I've invested three point mm. seven. You know, Marco, I want you to come. I would like you to ha to come here and have a conversation and talk about investments. I feel like. You understand more about investment because i feel like it's also one thing that we don't really know as black you know investing you know mm. if you can invest three million ah come on you Bar have to know something Bar 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 budget COVID. <laughs> <laughs> that's literally the entire budget yeah COVID, the one that they allocated <laughs> <laughs> but you see, the I'm most. Lie. I'm inspired, bro. I'm not gonna lie. You see here. To... So from from so if you go here, money in your transactions from from that date till now. Four point two bar. Four point two. Yeah, we can't see it. We can only see the twenty five percent battery. Take it down a bit. Uh -huh. Oh yeah. Ah, we can see it now. Yeah, four point two seventy. That's you like money in this like month. Me? Yeah, like I don't even know what this means. So what? How many accounts what, do you guys have? Like, it's what were you trading there, like. Marco? Was it Nas? Nasdaq. Uh, what was I trading? I was trading. Um... I mean, that four, four million. You made it from trading Nasdaq or? No, it's not only Nasdaq, but yeah, it's but that that should motivate you. you yeah, yeah, no, I. No, I've been they, seeing a lot of they millions. See. They have eyes. <laughs> they I'm they have gonna... eyes. Are they? They have eyes. No chill. Sure. My bank balance and yours is that four hundred and thirty-four. <laughs> yeah, nah. Uh, for me, my first. You and I. I'm not I. I, I you, you listen, guys. I'm not there yet. I'm being inspired. Trust me. But, uh, coach, one thing, man. I'm gonna be wealthy, bro. Too much work. 
definitely one or the other. There. People should know now, but now I'm not. <laughs> you understand? Yeah. So I'll come with one day, maybe I'll talk about it. But hey, for now, I'm fit. You guys are inspiring me. I won't lie to you. And 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 you don't need to do what we do to make it. Nah. You don't. Nah, like you don't. Literally, you can make yeah. this from another department. Yes. That's totally different. Yes, there's yeah. so many ways to make me. Yeah. So when so I, I, I know a lot of people, I, I know a lot of people. I, I was high, but when I'm high, I speak the truth. Yo, when I'm high, I speak. You, you must smoke. smoke. That's what. Smoke. Why did you smoke? I, I was I high as hell, but when I'm high, I speak the truth, and I did speak about the fact that the people in this industry aren't doing my numbers. But you want to come, you want to come at me, but you're not doing my numbers. You want to come at me, but you're not doing my numbers. How, yeah. how does that make sense? Yeah. So do you get a type of vibe? So it's like, hey, whatever. But that's the thing. Like, I, I, I went on a live once and I was like, listen, people, people, want to, people want to talk trash about you. People want to do that. But they're not even at your level. So why even entertaining them? It goes back to that. You understand why are we entertaining people why would i be entertaining someone like andamos it, it doesn't it wouldn't make sense to me it doesn't make sense to me Do you understand he's just not there can, and it's can, not me it's can, not me belittling him it's the can, facts of the matter being that he's just not on my level can, there's many traders out there that are right. not on my level we're, we are not asking for much we just want to see two hundred and fifty thousand. not much not uh, six million or whatever. Uh, hey. Two hundred and fifty. Uh, and the most. No, oh, hey, hey, I was just like, hey, two hundred and fifty thousand. <laughs> uh, you will never see it. No, so, but that's what, me, that's like, what I'm saying. Please. So I'm gonna be I'm gonna be I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be honest, yeah. There were so many there were so many names that were being mentioned when I was high and I was live, right? But in my head, I was like, show me one of them who is a quarter of a way to being a billionaire. We're not talking a millionaire. We're talking a billionaire in three years. Uh, uh, you 2019. Are the first one I know. I don't know any. 2019. Uh, so the first time so I was so live, so I was so live, so hold on, so coach, so remember, so I was live, I was live with coach, right? I was live with coach in Sunnyside, where I showed him a 66 million rand account. Yeah, I remember. 63, I remember. 62 or 66, Somewhere in his hands, like, yeah, there. on my r and app, boom, there's, mm -hmm. the, the, there's the money, do you understand? Mm -hmm. But now... That 66 million is sitting at 258 million. Now people will come at, come, people would come to you and be like, oh, Marco, you're making money from and your students. That, that was like How a much? year ago, right? Oh. It was about a year ago, yeah. I think. Yeah. How many students would need to have paid me to make that? How? It doesn't How? make That's sense. So... How? So when people, when people come at me, I'm like, look, the truth of the matter is because people are like marco how come you have an m8 because i've got an m8 competition an x5 competition you understand i just recently purchased a lambo and that's not even a joke a euros i put a three million rand deposit down i can even show you the the payment uh, and what the but, but just, at the end of the day just, what i'm saying just is to, just to add on that uh, no chill just just to add on that <laughs> You guys are like, hey, just, what's hey, just, hey, just to, just, just to, just you to add on that. You think I'm going to after this? You guys just, are just, just killing me. Just, you know? to, just to add on that, I understand what Marco is literally saying about building equity. Just to, just, just to add, Jay, just to add on that. Yeah, continue, Marco. So, yeah, no, so what I'm saying, level, what I'm saying is, yeah. What I'm saying is that, um, you know, people are like, ah, oh, Marco, how can you afford the jet? Because a gown like this, 132,000. 132,000 for this gown. It's not your normal Versace. You understand? It's an exclusive. But what I'm saying is, you know, people are like, Marco, how can you spend, you know, how do you spend 40,000 on a Louis Vuitton blanket? I can afford to. How much was the blanket? 40. Uh, and then people be like, ah. Buy a blanket. Just then there's people who are like, bringing to us with, with 7,000 uh, 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 slippers and push in. So what's wrong with them? They no, what I'm saying is. For that blanket. 
Fuck Guys, if I had to show you, let me let me show you. Let me let me show you the type of shopping I do. Just just look at the bags. Just the bags. Hmm. Ah, just bags. I know. Anna, yeah, that's not my scenery. LV, Gucci, Dolce, Gabbana, what's what? Ah, no chill. And I don't like those ones, talk yo. Ah, yeah, yeah. But I'm saying uh, things. Yeah. Bro, now I only see these things on social media, bro. Now, to be honest, I don't like, I've never seen any of these things outside. I've never felt it. You feel me? I won't lie. I'm not going to pretend. So you guys is just showing me like and we we, we you know what the real thing you see here. Inspired. I don't know. But I'm waiting now. Do the you guys, I don't know if there's anything that I did. Here's a Cartier. Here's sorry. a Cartier bracelet. Just this bracelet. Just this bracelet alone. Just this bracelet alone, right? Is over two hundred thousand. Just this rose gold bracelet 23. from Cartier. Is that twenty? Three, uh, 33 million guys why are you traumatizing me okay what do you marco yeah what do i do to you <laughs> nothing <laughs> so why are you i'm still i'm still i'm still going easy i haven't put out a rolex i haven't put out a attack i haven't anything <laughs> wrong to you my nigga Talk, be honest with me man i will apologize right now who do you okay Show me one person that you know can do what I'm about to do now. Now. Uh, you know Kaji. Do something new. Hold on. <laughs> you know Kaji. Let me just go in there quickly. Uh, and just show what you. To you guys? Like, why are you attacking me? <laughs> no, we're, so, we're not attacking you. We are, we are, we are putting the stamp or people should stop claiming our lives got in the That's what I'm going to say. So let's 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 go into the quickly, right? We can all see that this is Cartier, right? What is Cartier, bro? You don't know Cartier? Are you? What? What about when it comes to fishing? Okay. So I've got the all white Cartier lab bracelet. We all know that that one. That one alone. That one alone is sitting at a hundred and fifty thousand. That one alone. Then what I've got that? the Isn't all white. The same one like this. I've got an all white one. Right? Is it, Which is, is white, like this a, white gold. Is it a bracelet? Ah, you can see, and the, there's the indigree. The, in there. So, hold on. Then, now, here, I've got a rose gold love bracelet. Ne? I don't, I yeah. don't, I don't really know why I'm here. To be honest, if if I have to, yeah. be to everyone, yeah. I yeah. don't know why I'm yeah. here. So, yeah. Yeah. and then oh, I've you are got the gold, <laughs> and then I've got the gold love bracelet. Now, one bracelet like this, ne? One bracelet like this is two hundred and forty thousand. Just making an example. This one here is sitting at about one seventy or one ninety. No, the rose gold. Rose gold is sitting at 190, 170. I'm just, I'm just saying that this is all, all just Cartier. I, I don't know what why I'm Cartier? here. Because I have nothing to show. Right, me, I want to show you my podcast. This is where I want to be here. Because uh, <laughs> next you'll be sitting here, bro. <laughs> like, honestly, that's what I can show right now. I won't lie, guys. I'm not going to pretend. <laughs> huh? <laughs> uh, 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 Marco, please. Marco, I'll allow you to come to Okay, let's go. Hold on. Let's go. Let's quickly go. Let's go onto the internet here. Let's just see what one of the bracelet costs. Just so people can see that we are not I'm not I'm not claiming, right? So let's go in here. Let's go out of this. Let's go cancel that. New tab. Let's go car. Cartier, there's a there. Cartier bracelet. So let's look at something like this, which is pre-owned. 
because it's better than 15,000. So what, what do you do with this? Do you wear them? Do you resell them? Yeah, Is you wear them. Or you wear them? Yeah. So now How let's go into... find this at Marava Start Mus at 200? Yeah, but then they're not genuine. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> I know. <laughs> I'm just saying people are not knowledgeable about this brand. I'm quite sure. So look, I think yeah. it's, it's, these yeah. are the prices we're looking at. Australian dollars. Yeah, I can see. Yeah, Australian dollar is not so far from the US, right? No. In terms of exchange rate. Yeah, just below but a bit. Let's go into shopping. Just so we can see the prices. Um, uh, uh, trying to see. Um, trying to see proper prices. Yeah. But yeah, like something, something like that. That would be something like this. Oh, 177. Most is the same one that you have, more or less, similar. It's exactly the same one. It's a love bangle. What is it made of? Is it bronze, diamond, gold? No, man, this is, is gold. Oh, it's this oh it's gold yeah, yeah. Uh, so what i'm saying so is, is that one day like what uh, abo abo beyonce and who and and what not wears look at this one this one here is two hundred and forty thousand, similar to this so you are telling me that you're wearing two hundred and forty thousand there on my, my wrist imagine What's that? That's in Damos's net worth. Why are you doing that, Marco? No, no, man. You, <laughs> I knew you, you were going to come and say something. Like you can't. You can't do that. Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah. You can't do that. Even if uh, I had to go look at this. Yeah. Huh? I'm saying otherwise, they can see that there there is no amount of money that you can pay for lessons that can do what we what no, we never. showing them yeah. uh, they 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 can see and now from my side i want everyone to know and remember very well that i come from nothing when i marco you you were born in italy you were born it in doesn't matter. i don't think Let me show them. Nah, i want to i want to show them you were, you were something poor, marco i doubt you were poor. you I poor? Was. like like poor poor yes I what want to show them something. I want to show them something. Hold on. Yeah? Mm. I want to show them something now. Social mm. cartridges and emails. Am I logged in? Mm. Marco, I know you are not, you are not poor. Ah, yeah, yeah, I doubt. Yeah. I, okay. I don't come yeah. from a shack. <laughs> right? So... Let's go yeah. to Curtis search. <laughs> so here you, you can already see. Oh, mm -hmm. they they also do the special invites like what Gucci is. No, doing look here, look at appointment. look here, look here. International limited warranty. So you can just see that you see this watch that I'm wearing. Mm. It's a genuine. I'm just showing you that my pieces are genuine. They're not Marabasa. Um, how much is that watch? This watch, yeah, for four hundred and ninety thousand, half a million. So these South African rappers who are making noise, you are working, you are wearing uh, what we call spikiri. On the other side is two hundred and fifty. Here's a, here's a white, white one, half a million as well. Most these rappers are still claiming they don't know you. Yeah, no. What I'm saying is here's the white one okay. that goes with my white gold Cartier bracelet. So I've got a gold. But when I wear my gold watch, like now, then I've got my white gold, but when I wear my silver watch. Oh, oh you have both watches. Which one is more yeah. expensive between the two? I have the gold, 100%. Oh, 100%. Okay, makes sense. Yeah, gold, I mean, makes sense. Yeah. But Mark, I don't what understand. I'm Show mm -hmm. us that one which looks like a nail. Uh, 
topic in English. Is it nail? You are saying Marco. You paid Marco. You paid two hundred and fifty thousand for it's white gold. For this thing, listen for this thing that you can find at Cash Build. <laughs> Remember now, I'm not knowledgeable. So to me, I I see it as speaking literally as a nail. What what? But I can see the brand. I think I can see. This thing is two hundred and fifty thousand. Yep. Spikiri. Yep. It's a literally. They just took an uh, that metal thing and then they bend it to fit your hand. Then they write kate kata what what. You can find these things, Marco. You must yeah. next time give me the money. I'll go buy these things for you. I'll, I can bring a hundred of them. Don't I don't need, I don't need, I don't, I don't need, I don't need from Shin or Maraba start. I need, I'm I need from strong, Kati. Man. You cannot spend 250,000 for Spikiri, Marco, that you can find at cash bills. Ah, uh, dog. Or maybe I'm just not into fishing and jewelry. Yeah, you're not. I don't understand. Thoughts. You see here. No, I'm not. Because Even if it you was look, the first time look I at this one. Look at this, ever. look at this Kati bracelet. After you give it to a girl, then she cheats on you with a, with a, five, a five, five hundred and eighty eight thousand, five hundred and eighty eight thousand five hundred and thirty. Uh women in South Africa don't deserve this one. They're gonna cheat on you with a TikTok. Who knows how to dance? You can't dance. I'm sure you can't dance. They're mm -hmm. gonna cheat on you. Umre <laughs> gets into six hundred thousand with a TikTok dancer. You see, women. Yeah. Ne ne? And here, I... see the, this one and this one, same WhatsApp group. Yeah, I can see the price range. So you buy these things like online or you... And, and this one is pre-owned. This is pre-owned. That one is 220,000 200, used. Mm. Then brand new is 3 million. No, they're about, they're about two. The gold one is about... Uh, two two sixty. Like, like brand new, brand new, brand new, brand, brand new. new. I bought mine brand new. It was about two sixty. But imagine telling someone I'm wearing your GTI on my wrist. <laughs> <laughs> Marco, don't back. Marco, 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 you? don't, don't. Because you are going yeah. to hurt me. I just bought a GTI, so you can't tell me you're wearing a GTI. Check here. <laughs> There's a two foot. Two thousand. <laughs> well, imagine, you imagine tonight. someone, imagine trying, imagine someone fighting you. Imagine someone fighting you. They don't know what you're wearing, and then Not, you're leaning on their car. You're leaning that, on their car, that, and they're like, "Please, my man, can you stop leaning, leaning on my car? Just you know, you you know, it's 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 it 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 it, it cost. Like, let's say, let's say he was trying to go at you, and he was like, "Yeah, my man, can you please stop? Oh, I'm sorry. How much is this car?" Oh, it's 250. Oh, yeah, no, take my bracelet. Go put my bracelet. You uh, can pay for that con. <laughs> uh, look, at, look at what uh, your, your, your hater is driving. He's driving this one. Uh, Kia Picanto. This one. It's 129,000. He's driving a 27 I 10. It's 129,000. So his car is not even, at least my GTI. So, you are wearing the Moses I-10 times three or four, or if not four. Mm -hmm. Guys, some people are rich. White people are rich. Marco is white, guys. He's not black. So, don't mm -hmm. compare yourself with him. See, this one, yeah, this one is a rose. This one is rose gold. 277. Here's rose gold. I have all of them, man. I have all of them. So, like, you are, you are passionate about this thing. I love, I love, I love these love. I, I love, I love Cartier. You can come over here, and check. I love Cartier. These are the two here. I've got another like four in the room. I love Cartier. Cartier, Cartier, Cartier. Cartier. They call mm, it what? Cartier. Yeah. Cartier. Yeah, I have 
have an Indian guy who can get me these things tomorrow if I ask him fast. I will go not ask him. Because, nah, not for Maraba Sat, the real thing, ne? Ah, uh, Mark, I'm not going to spend uh, 277,000 on a bracelet. That looks like a speaker from Cash Build. I, Mark, why? <laughs> Give me zero. I don't know. I would rather. I would rather do BBL. I would rather go do BBL on my body, increase Mention. my dick. Ha! Ah. Guys, even if I had to try go down, you must remember that I stay, I stay, I stay at a hotel. So the minute I go into the basement, I lose signals. Otherwise, I would have showed you my cars a long time ago. But I've shown my cars many times, so it's yeah, not no, like. I, I, I've, what is the latest that you bought now? It's the Lamborghini. Yeah, the Lamborghini yours. Before then, what are the latest two that you bought before? No, remember I had the, that I have the M8 when I did the live with you. Oh, uh, you you were uh, you just recently ordered for it that time. Oh, okay. That time. Yeah, so I've got oh, the M8. Deliver. Yeah, I didn't see the delivery, but I've seen the invoice. You paid for it. Yeah. I think it was two point eight, ne? Yeah. I think. Yeah. Oh, I remember. Yeah, yeah I've I got remember. the up, so, so, oh, and and I've obviously got the uh, um an X5M now competition. How much was it? About three, I don't know, three, three, two, three, but three billion. Let's say, let's say three it million. Bulletproof no, no. Or oh, it's just a standard. Yeah. Hey, bulletproofing goes to five million, five and a half million. Five, four, six, ne? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think at this but stage, Marco, you need to get bulletproof cars and you must not live in South Africa anymore. You are too much for us, Marco. I no. too much. But people thought, I, I feel like. People, people thought I was joking when I told them, listen, guys, I'm, 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 I'm a quarter of a way to being a billionaire. Not a millionaire, a billionaire. At the age of what, like 30, eh? 31. 31, okay. I'm 28. So three years down the line, uh, I, should, I should have progress. <laughs> but the problem is you would already be on, on a billionaire status. <laughs> That's the problem. You're not going to spend. Because if you're able to take 60 million to almost 260 in like a year, mm. shit. Yeah, I know. I, it's not make sure. But, but it, otherwise, it, it most needs to be made. Yeah. Yeah, most importantly, I, I hope uh, these guys are inspired. That's the thing. Hope. People think, people think we're showing off, and really we're not. We're really yeah. just trying to show you. We, as much as it's jokes and yeah, we're showing you some real things and we're showing you, you know, crazy amounts of money and stuff. It's more to say, listen, because we're not superhuman. People must understand that. I'm not superhuman. I'm sure there's many people who can get to my, 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 my level within a few years. It's just about putting in the hard work and showing you that, listen, hey, brah, you too, you can get there. It's not like you, you, you can't. You too, you can get there. It's just about knowing and understanding that you can get there and but also understanding that listen there's a lot of work that goes into getting there it's yeah. not just so guys, don't just guys there's there's uh three steps uh of 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 letters that you need to take to success step number one you must be like in damos i get step one is to be like in damos uh oh. almost sixty thousand value somewhere there step two come to my level jump at least to a couple of millis then step three, quarter of a million. That is Marco's level. No, I think they get the grip. The grip. The, the grip. They, they understand. Yes, but the stone. Yeah. They, they understand. You saw the stone that I have, no? You see it? Yeah, the, the, the big one. diamonds. Mm. Where is it? The, one, the ones that you showed us like the first, first, first time. Yeah. No, but this, this, this one here, I think it's beautiful. Let me see. How much is is it worth? I wanna, I wanna, I wanna buy it. Uh, I wanna get married, Marco. How much are you gonna sell that one for? Uh, for? I wanna buy it and 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 marry this this gay guy that I love so much. How much is it? <laughs> <laughs> if I marry a man, at least he he won't fuck me up. These women are not loyal. How much is that man? stone? How much is that stone? What? This year? Yeah. That one that you're holding now. This is a... Two, three... But over three million. Three million. Over three million, yeah. 
So this I can buy one here. This one here. Yeah. This one here is cheaper. This one here. What is the cheapest this is, is that you have? This is a V. This is this is a this is a double VS two, but it's cut. But it's cut in a G format, so the color is G, which is rather, it's clean, but it's not as clean as the previous one. How much is that one? What is the cheapest tone that you have? Um, probably something like, like this. Okay, how much? I want the cheapest. I kind of want to see what I can afford. <laughs> That's why I'm asking about the cheapest. How much is that but one? This one here, this mm. one here is sitting at about one no about 980 close to a million you see not 980,000 eh? yeah yeah you see that one i can afford to buy even tomorrow not three million but also the biggest question is who deserves to wear a ring worth one million that is the biggest question I think we must consider marrying one another, Marco, in, in future because uh, uh, this woman will kill us. <laughs> this woman will kill us. If, if there's no way a woman wouldn't kill you with such. I can And then Omonga Ashu, one of those haters saying diamonds are fake, where else his name is Diamond. Corey, I don't know which one is fake, between his name or the Diamond. People are weird out there. I... It's easy to see if diamonds are real. Let me show you. Watch this. Watch them. Watch them. Watch them shine. Then you'll see that they're real. Oh, that's how you see. Oh yes, yes. I've seen this in movies. Oh yes. So there's no way there's there, there's no way they they but obviously they would shine if they are no. real, basically. Obviously, if they're, not, if they're not real, they wouldn't shine like that. Um, but also, uh, you know, it comes with the certificates. Um, it's also um, G G I I certified. Where's my certificate? Oh, my certificate's not here. It's in the room. I'm lazy to go get it. But yeah, so it's G I I certified. Um, but yeah, that's how you that's how you can see. You just just yeah. shine a light. The best way guys, is to shine a UV, a UV guys, light. Which, but if you shine a light, girl, but if you just girl on this shine a light like that, that just yeah. like, like that. Guys, which girl on this live can I buy the hundred and I mean the nine hundred and eighty thousand diamond for right now? Which one deserves it on the on the live right now? I want even, to get married like now. Marco, I want even, to buy the nine hundred and eighty one. Hmm. It's the one that's not going to cripple me. <laughs> no, but what I'm saying is, time. even if you, even if you listen to them, so obviously diamond is rocks. Yeah, I can I can hear the sound. Guys, who should I marry? Nine hundred and eighty thousand diamond on your ring, right, right now. Who deserves it? Ah, le na problem le ratari TikTok, le na lo kuma khal jeli magaoche kunyo bishari bari. Oh, Arang, not me. I see what you're doing. <laughs> There's no way you wouldn't want the diamond, girl. Ah, uh ah. -uh. There's no way. Stop lying. Ah, yeah, yeah. Unless if Marco is your uncle, then it will make sense. <laughs> but if not, there is no way you can have, you cannot want a diamond on your ring, girl. Or when you ring, you have 500. <laughs> Fuck! These things are beautiful, mm -hmm. yeah. and they're pure. So, so the purity level here is um. So I do V, I do double V as two. So the purity level there is two away from being a hundred percent purity. So I would say, if we were talking purity in diamonds, yeah, I would say we're probably looking at at least between 92 all the way to 96 because obviously um if and if is full-on purity okay okay yeah so that just and then what the, that means the more pure what they that are, means the more expensive they get basically yeah so obviously what, what what that means is how clean the stone actually is 
So um, how? So obviously that's going to also tell you how bright it's going to sparkle, because the cleaner the stone, the cleaner the stone. Obviously, the more it's going to sparkle. You understand? Mm. So it's some stones might have. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I get what you mean. Makes sense. But at the end of the day, I feel like I feel like with 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 a very clean with a very clean stone. You know, with a very, very clean stone, um, you know, you're going to be able to, obviously this is already cut and polished, but what happens is, so the actual procedure in regards to diamonds is, so when it comes, when it, when, when it comes over from Congo or the DRC, right, mm. um, then what actually happens is the, 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 the rock comes in a format, like it looks like a, a mess. It looks looks like a very dull piece of stone mm -hmm. right okay. and then normally the stone would come in and it would be yellow with black spots or something you understand mm. then what happens is we then boil the diamond so we then boil the stone it's not a diamond yet oh, right it's not a diamond yet okay yeah it's not a diamond yet yeah. so what happens is the 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 um the stone right is very dull and it's it's very blur it's not it's not it doesn't look like this right mm -hmm. then after that after that what happens is we then boil the stone to try get as much white out of the stone so we try we boil it to get the yellow right yeah um we boil it to see uh, how much how much yellow we can get out of the stone and how much black spots we can get um, reduced in regards to um, the, the the stones, right? And then from there, and then from there, what happens is you can have a stone that big, but get a diamond that small out of it because the stone around oh, it is just very yeah. yellow and. Because we yeah. try to boil it as much as possible, sometimes overboiling it can damage the stone. But in most cases, we know how to boil the stones. So what happens is you might find a diamond this small and get something that big out of it. So it all comes down to your luck in regards to the person who's mining and 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 how how great of a miner this person is. And when 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 he breaks out the stone, right? Is it, how 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 correctly does he break it out? Because a lot of people might break it out incorrectly and lose a lot of the purity and the fineness in a rock. You understand? Okay. So once you boil it and everything, that's when you can start seeing the whiteness. And then what happens is you then take it to a jeweler who then cuts it, and they then polish it. And when they polish it, it starts to look like that. Oh. So basically, there now, are people who get paid to do all this process. Yes. So you take, yes. So obviously, you take it to a jeweler, and um, they then show they, they they then bring something out of this rock yeah. that looks I've, like I've, this, I've which actually, is this making. I've actually seen one hell of a big stone, but I think it was almost raw. Uh, from yeah. I just, I forgot about it from uh, you know Tammy Taylor the the Tommy Taylor nail what what they have a division for jewelry as well so the CEO I was I was I I, I met the CEO mm -hmm. and he was telling me about the diamond business uh, speaking about millions and whatnot that didn't even understand so now it, it makes sense as to how the stone was so big but after the boiling and everything it becomes small makes sense yes so you could find out that this came from a huge stone, a raw diamond. This came from a raw diamond, right, into this type of purity. Whereas that could have come from a size just a little bit bigger than that, but because yes. of the way it was mined and pulled, you know, the person did it correctly, and we get a more, a, a more purified um, stone in regards to diamond when we start to cut it and uh, boil it and obviously polish it up and make it look as beautiful as it is now. Mm. So also but, cutting it wrongly could damage it as well. Shit. 100%, 100%. But what I'm saying is, what I'm, what, what I'm saying is that all of this still came from Forex. Thank you. Not lessons. Forex itself. Thank you.
This Thank all you. came from trading. This all came from me saving money. This all came from me wanting to make money, to make more money and invest money to make more money and more money. You understand? So now I buy rocks. So now I buy raw stone from the DRC, which is Congo. I have my people here who then cut it, polish it, boil it, and it's another source of income. So basically, this is like a business. You sell it at a higher price. Because yeah. so you must remember that I can buy I can buy a raw stone. I can buy a raw stone for four hundred thousand rand. Right? Let's say the raw stone is about 350 grams, right? Mm. Let's say it's about 350 grams. Then what I do, right, is I take the 350 gram stone and out of that stone comes something of this nature. Okay. Right? Now here okay. we're looking at about close to four carats, right? Okay. Right? okay. So yeah. if you look at a stone like that, you might find out that, okay, fine, we've got this four um, carat stone, but what was spent was only 400,000. How much profit so you can, you can have I made? You can buy that raw thing, cut 400,000, and then after polish it, cut it, do the whole thing, and then the value increases to 2 million. Just like that. Just like that. Now, remember that the polishing yeah. and, 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 and um, you know, the, 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 the cutting and whatever not costs money, but n n nothing close. I would say maybe a stone half a million but that stone right now you see this is it's 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 it, it, it's the same as you see you don't know you don't know the outcome i could get a stone for four hundred thousand and get a diamond this small or i can get a stone that is just once 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 i start once i start boiling it i can just see that the stone is really worthless they, uh, you know and then i could lose four hundred thousand but it's a win oh. and lose Okay, oh, you understand? Yeah. So I get what you mean. You're not guaranteed to get me. you're not guaranteed, but in in most cases, in most cases, there's about I would say 80-85% chance that you're gonna get a stone that's going to give that's going to give you some kind of diamond. Even if it's a one carat or even if it's a 0 0.50 carat or whatever the case is, but you're gonna get something out of it that's going to be a little bit more. You might just break even. Or you might just be able to make maybe 200,000 off what you paid for the stone. But that's why what we do is you start understanding that um, you want a person to start mining from this side, from the east side of the mine or the west side of the mine, because you've realized that the west side of the mine um, produces and gives you better results in regards to stones and the polishing and cutting becomes a lot better because now maybe you get a G cut or an H cut um, uh, stone, which is then, that then um, obviously defines the color of the stone. So G, H is really refined, really great color. And then uh, you get uh, maybe the diamond being a double VS2 or double VS1 or a VS2 or VS1. Um, you could even get a, um, a F1 or an F, which is very rare, but if you do get an F, it's a lot of money. Yeah. Right. So beside be, between the VS one, VS two, which one has more value? So the F so the F one is 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 pure, 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 hundred percent pure diamond. Yeah. Right. Then we get the 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 the, the, the um the so that's the F. Then the F one is second to pure. You you understand? Mm. So you get the IF, right, which is basically purity but not as pure as your um level f so you get f i f then you start getting what i'm bringing in now double v s2 and double v s1 which is rather at the same level and then you get v s uh one and v s2 which is a little bit less impurity but still a good rock and you can still okay, yeah. produce a really nice diamond from it you understand now your american swiss sell vs2 vs1 um browns would probably sell more a double vs2 something like this or double vs1 whereas your beyonce's are going to go for that pure um oh, yeah. yes. you get me because they're gonna sense. afford that yeah and then tata tata costancy which is a 500 rand double. what is it like the the leftovers of the water that they used to boil 
or what are those? Because huh? you can literally buy it. This is a diamond watch for one thousand or five hundred. Like, what level of fakeness is that one? So, so uh, you must remember that um, when a watch is iced out, right? You must understand that a real diamond, a real diamond, will shine. It will sparkle. It will sparkle, sparkle, and you can never get that in a fake. In a fake, it will sparkle, but a person who knows a diamond will be like, no, real diamonds really sparkle. That, that sparkles, but it's not sparkling like a real diamond. It's supposed to sparkle. You understand? Mm -hmm. So I feel like people who know the industry, like now, I know diamonds. So when I see a diamond, I can automatically be like, ah, that one, that's not it. Mm -hmm. Even something as, 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 as low purity and, 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 and not refined cutting is as like maybe a VS2 or a VS1, mm. right? Even that will sparkle. Oh. You understand? So yeah. these, ones, these ones that you see and they just out there, uh, I've seen a lot of, now, now I can really differentiate between diamonds and, and fake diamonds. And I see a lot of people wearing fake. I do. Mm. You understand? Mm. I see a lot of people wearing fake and I see a lot of people, um, you know, trying to claim that, you know, they are in, you know, this industry or whatever not. Now, a lot of people who are forex traders, I've seen them. A lot of them, we went bling bling from here and it's not real. I'm going to be honest. Because you must understand, <laughs> to wear bling bling from here to here and it's, the rocks are as big as this. My friend, Beyonce doesn't even wear that. So you're telling me you have so, more money than Beyonce. So this, this Forex nigga Zua and this rappers in South Africa who are saying they're wearing diamonds, it's fake shit. It's all, it's all something that looks like diamonds but isn't diamonds. Guys, diamonds is extremely expensive. If we had to go here, let's go into the internet quickly. Let me just show you what a, norm, a normal v, double VS2 diamond goes for. Uh... Price on double V is to diamond. So if we start looking now, you see, so something that's in the range of, uh, So this is still cheap, but what I'm saying is that. Uh, I so this is just, this is just a cushion so lab. This, this, this is just this is just this is just a this is just a cushion. Rejects. We call them rejects, ne? Basically. Yeah, this is just a cushion lab crown. So a cushion lab crown is even smaller than this. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So this nigga smaller are, than this, and they're making that is sitting. Can you, can you, can you reject? Yeah, 75,000. Hey. But they... Oh, this hey. rapper is so, screaming. Hey. If you look over here... There's a oh, yes. 2 million yes. rand stone. That's a VS2. I can see. 4.11 carats. 4. Yeah, 4.11 carats. Yeah, then correct. Here is a... GIA certified VVS2. 3.2 so carats. Tell me, tell me, Marco, if I see a person wearing whatever that diamond, is there any certificate for it? Or 100%. 100%. 100%. So this now, nigga must start giving us certificates ne, for these diamonds that they claim they are wearing. Yeah, no, the, most of them aren't wearing diamonds, so it's fine. Actually, all of them are not wearing diamonds now that i know vvs1 vvs2 yeah so one, vv not, so they, vv so i know yeah yeah so a vv a, a vvs1 mm. no wait, wait. Mm. here we've got here we've got an if 29 29 million guys yeah yeah like Ooh, how many carrots 
are, are there in, in that story? 2.1. 2. 2. 29 million rents. Mm -hmm. Even here, look at this. This is, I can't see. So this is a D1, which is okay quality, but this is a five carat, but look at it, 2.8 million. Mm, mm. Yeah, I can see. I can see. <laughs> Wait, Marco, is it, yeah. is, it, is it carrots or carrots or carrots I, or what? Because people are saying carrots. I, potato, How do you potato. How do you pronounce it the right way? I say, I say carrots, carrot, carrots. Wait, wait. Um, as in like the carrots that we eat, so, sort of the same thing in a way, the, the way it sounds. Yeah, so this, you see this one here, mm. 111,000 Rand for yeah. a, a IF, um, seven carats diamond. So IF is expensive, as you can see, it goes over the 100 million Rand mark. Mm. Yo, yeah, no, those ones are for pure billionaires. Uh, it makes sense. But what I have here in the tray, these ones here, these ones are sitting. Uh, the bigger ones are double VS2s. No, the big ones are double VS1s. Second to the biggest is uh, uh, double VS2s, and mm. the other ones are double VS2s also. Yeah. So, like I was saying, you know, you get the, you get you get you get your purity from different places. So, obviously, if you if 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 you know that like the the south the south or the west side of the mine brings out better purity in regards to double VS2, or you know that this side of the, this side of the mine brings out that type of purity. Maybe, maybe you know that, okay, to get IF purity, you need to go to the north side of the mine. But you need to go to oh. the right person because if a person doesn't, you know, mine it correctly and get it out, of his train correctly, then um, you could lose a lot of the purity. Mm. Okay. No, makes sense. So, Yo, no, this this whole diamond business really wants you to have a net worth that's out of this world. It makes sense why you can easily handle a stone worth three million just like yeah. that, yeah. because it needs you to have that knowledge and understand that business deeper. I don't think it's for everyone, this one. No, 100%. But it's the same as, it's the same as, um, you know, trans, transporting, like what I also do is transport fuel, petrol, gasoline. Oh, oh so yes, I, yes. I send it over to Mozambique, Kenya, um, Malawi, you understand? The African um, nations out there. Yeah, cons oh, 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 uh, yeah. But yeah, like Zambia, Malawi. Um, so obviously, we send it through um, Manusius, and then it goes over to um, uh, what's that place? Uh, Bakikari, Bakikari. Uh, they in 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 Zimbabwe, and then from there, um, you know, it can even go over to um, what's this place, man, in Zimbabwe. But uh, sometimes, sometimes you get um, over the border. We have to go through Zimbabwe to get to Namibia, or oh, you get me. So, also a nice game to be playing in in regards to money. But again, it all came down to trading, making money Everything. here and investing Thank here you. for there. You you started somewhere and built mm. whatever that you're doing. Mm. Yeah. So. That's what it comes down to. It comes down to, if you're going to think about today only, then the outcome will only be today. Tomorrow you'll see yourself. But if you're thinking yeah. about tomorrow, you'll get, you, you can get to this level. Mm. Uh, but not, not, not in this diamond business. Uh, this one I can tell you from a distance. The, the way you're explaining the process of buying a stone and then getting someone who's gonna wash it, polish it. You, you need to be well connected, even know when you're done with the whole production, who's gonna buy it. And yeah. me knowing black people, remember Marco, you are not black, you are white. Me knowing yeah. my black people, 
that diamond will be in Atrejville. Uh, people will not even know the worth. People will not even understand and know the worth. This business is not for us black people. Rena, tell us about Forex only. Tenders. You see tenders, politics, Forex, and going to school knowing very well that we are not going to get jobs. That's where we excel. And also getting married to divorce, having unnecessary sex. Those are, we specialize with those things. This kind of business, <laughs> owning brokers, diamond business, transporting fuel, agriculture. We as black people don't have knowledge. We are far away from these things. Ah, uh, this one is not for us. I can but tell you. I know, I know. In most cases, in most cases, um, even the guy who owns the mine, Muli, uh, even the guy who owns the mine, Muli, uh, he is um, he's Jewish. You see? The Jewish guy. You guy, cannot find it's a, a Jewish black guy. Person. It's actually three, three Jewish guys that own the mine in Congo, uh, the DRC, where the diamonds come from. So, what should we do, Marco, as black people? Because we hear you, ne? Invest, hear invest, you, ne? invest. You can't <laughs> just say invest, invest, invest. You know, skin color is a problem, Marco. <laughs> it's easier for you. <laughs> When you go to DRC, where now when you go that side, they they easily respect you. I'm black. I look like a thug dog. When I get there, they will think I'm there to steal. The skin color is a problem. No, no but there's there's there's, there's 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 black people like there are there's 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 there's, there's a guy called Tabiso that I'm that I met there. Mm. Um, guys from here. There's another guy, uh, Lungile. To, who work to steal the diamonds. Their job is to steal the diamonds. Black people are not normal. That's what I'm <laughs> trying to tell you. This kind of business, we are controlled too much by greedy. You see the whole process of you explaining yeah. that you buy a stone for 400, you polish it, blah, blah, blah. You sell it for 2 million. Now, I would rather let you buy that stone, polish it, then I come steal it from you when you are done. That's how we black people think. That is the biggest problem. Yeah, That's why... See now, let's say, let's say someone comes in and let's say, you wouldn't get into this hotel, but I'm just saying, let's say you got into this hotel, we got into my uh, hotel apartment, right? Good luck, but I'm just saying, you know, you got in here, whatever the case is, and then fine, you get the diamonds, but you don't get the certificate with the diamonds, then the diamonds are pretty useless because no one's, no one's really going to pay what you could be getting, you understand? Yeah. That's why but, I told you those diamonds will end up in Social Google. That's what I'm telling you. <laughs> <laughs> you don't need a certificate in Social Google because they're going to sell it for 3000 that's, 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 that's what I'm saying. Black people don't understand this nature of the business. That is our biggest problem. And not that we don't understand, Marcone. It's, it's, you are literally the first person in my life mm. who has actually explained how this business works. And now I, I have a little bit of knowledge. But mm. now, how many Marcos do we have? And, yeah. and I'm a black guy, you are white. How many coaches do we have that can connect black people to Marco? Do you understand what I mean? What are mm. the odds? You see, so without me connecting this black niggas, without you explaining this, then there is no hope for us. We wouldn't know the value of that money. Ah. Would be, ah. now, now you, you have just made me not uh, go to stands or American Swiss anymore. Because I know they're playing with us. Because now I literally thought that watch here, 1,200 co American Swiss, which looks like a diamond, I thought it's like a portion of it. I thought it was real. Genuinely, I thought it was no. real. Because I don't diamonds know. Are, diamonds are extremely expensive. Extremely. You see, expensive. now I know. And this niggas, there's this hip hop South African rappers who are saying, hey, I'm wearing diamonds. We used to believe them. Now I know these niggas are lying. These niggas are lying. These you must understand. You must understand. In order to have, in order to have a chain that's 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 iced out with these South African rappers that are, that, or these celebrities that have iced out, guys, for diamonds to, to have diamonds with 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 with, with, with that amount of 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 of, of um, carrots sitting on your neck. Guys, guys, even 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 the rappers over the seas don't even use real diamonds, man. Diamonds are expensive, guys. Diamonds are expensive. To have a chain, like some something, let's say let's say just maybe like a normal 19 centimeter chain iced out, 
something even as, sim- as thin as this, right? But there is something like maybe over 80 carats. Guys, do you understand? Yo, yo. That, chain, yeah. that, that chain will probably buy stain city. Fuck. <laughs> Get me. So, stain so city. Imagine. Buy estate so, where an apartment is worth 11 million. Mm. An apartment, not a house. Yeah, I get what you. What mean. I'm saying that's is, how expensive. You'll probably find you, 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 That's 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 what these things cost. Diamonds are not cheap. So when someone, this is you must remember now. This was a raw diamond sitting at this price now, right? This was a raw diamond that I then polished, and 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 now looks like this. But you must remember now they need to put their mark up because they're buying from us. Mm. Us who already have the diamonds, we going and we supplying American Swiss or we supplying grounds, right? Then at the end of the day, what markup are they going to put on? If I'm selling you a diamond for 2 million and it's a three carat, what is their markup going to be? At least two, three times that. Yeah, I get what you mean. So now they're selling a diamond for 7 million and it's something that's small. Now you want those seven, now now, now you want a hundred of those 7 million rand diamonds on your neck. Come on. Who can? afford that mm, mm. so when people I also I, once you get into this industry you'll start seeing that yay a lot of these people are just out there flaunting nothing they they they, 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 <laughs> they there's no diamonds there because we know what diamonds cost and we know what we're supposed to look for you understand it's the same as someone who's wearing let's say let's say you go buy gold fake gold and you go and try and, 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 you, and you start speaking to someone who deals in gold, they're going to be able to see that, listen, you're wearing fake gold. It's the same as me. Before, I wouldn't be able to differentiate whether you were wearing real diamonds or not. But now that I'm into diamonds, I'll be able to tell you straight up, that's not a diamond. Go lie to somebody else. You can lie to all these other people, but that's not a diamond. I get what you, you mean. Understand? And they've been lying to us, these niggas, because we don't know this thing. <laughs> we don't know. Not literally every, anything that shines even once, not even twice, just once a bit. To me, it's diamond. But now I know. Ah, now, now I'll just look a at... A diamond will look sparkle. At... A diamond will sparkle, sparkle, sparkle. A, a diamond will sparkle. Like a real diamond, in, you see in the sunlight, when, when a light is flashed at it, it will yes. sparkle. And it has a certain sparkle. So another thing is a diamond reflects in three different colors. Blue, and you, you can see that you can see it. Blue, yeah. right? Yeah. Blue, green, and yellow. But the yellow is an offish, it's 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 an offish orange. So when we look at a diamond, if I point a light at those diamonds, you'll see that it brings out those colors. Almost like a rainbow type of color. But when it sparkles like okay. in like, but if you shine a light at a diamond and it just sparkles like a white, bright, then it's a fake. Oh, it needs to have a little bit of bluish as well. It should have like a rainbow later, type of MWX effect 7. to it. Yeah, I get what you mean. Yeah. Understand? So when you look at a diamond and it doesn't have that kind of reflection, then automatically you know that no, this is not a diamond, because a genuine diamond will have that reflection. It's called the three color. It will have that three color reflection. If you're not getting that uh, reflection, then you got, you're clearly not wearing diamonds. You're, looking, you're wearing what? something that might seem and look like real what diamonds. Is I, what is ice box? They're asking what is ice box? Which one ice, is ice box? Ice, ice is basically diamonds. Oh, the one in Dubai. I've seen a video, I think, of that shop in Dubai. So they sell diamonds, real diamonds. Yeah, but now you must understand that, um, again, I can have mm. real diamonds, but the purity is not quite there. I can get very, very bad purity, something close to F. Yes, it's a oh, diamond, that's so, that's yes, so it's a diamond, it but it's a piece of shit. Mm. I understand what you mean. That's just so that they can be uh, profitable, because it's a business yeah. after all. 100%. So, yes, I might have a real diamond, right, all over my neck. But if I'm wearing F-type diamonds, then guys, you, you might as well go buy from Arabastad because we're pretty much in the same league. It's the, 
the worst diamond. It's the worst purity. It's the worst. I think. I think. But, but I think, it's still diamond, but it's the worst quality of it. Yes. So you know? when you, when if you're going to talk about diamond diamonds, we're talking about something like the Queen of England would wear. She would wear, um, obviously, a, a um, an IF. She would wear an IF diamond. You understand? Mm -hmm. She'd wear an mm -hmm. IF diamond, which is like top of its range, where that is just a hundred percent, hundred percent, hundred percent purity. But at the end of the day, well, she can afford it. But a normal person, it would cost the, it, 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 it's way out of their league. And they mm -hmm. you a multi, multi billion, 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 billionaire, sure. But these guys, here in South Africa, mm, mm, I get maybe you maybe mean. like your Elon Musk, your Petrus Mutsepes, they can wear that 100%. But these rappers, these, these, I oh, know, no, no. Mm, I get what you mean. Yeah, damn, eh? Ah, then I'll never look at people the same, <laughs> but um. <laughs> I'll never look at people. But even a lot of celebrities wouldn't wear real diamonds. Reason for that is because <laughs> real diamonds, real diamonds cost so much that even insurance companies can't afford to insure it. Makes sense. Makes sense. You know Makes it's sense. the same as having a supercar. There's insurance companies that cannot afford to insure the supercar. Okay, tell me, Marco, do you have insurance? For not tracker related, but the actual insurance for cover for covering your cars, and if, yeah, hundred percent. If not, why? Oh, okay. No, so I, you didn't say yeah. insurance is a scam. Oh, yeah. yeah referring, you know what? I feel to, like... that, to that angle because because I've I've I've, I've insured. Uh, I get. I once uh, bought two S trays in twenty eighteen. Ne, because now in twenty eighteen I was my license i was i had like one year with my license no experience with driving according to my license yeah so i was quoted by my way i was quoted twenty two thousand each car each car right and even if you were to pay an s3 on an installment you'd maybe play pay around boma twenty thousand. so it means the insurance i mean the premium was higher than the actual car you know yeah. installment if you were to take it that way so I've complained. They've cut it down to sixteen thousand each car, right? So I've 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 taken. I was paying about thirty two to thirty three thousand for both cars. Ne, on on the insurance, I get it was like my first uh, sports car. I would say, right? So I got into a, a, a minor accident. That the whole claiming process, they've denied to pay. Uh, during the course of the accident, I didn't take pictures, just stupid things. What, 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 what? Oh, another reason was uh, I didn't send them the pictures of the, the car, but they were deducting 32,000 without requesting for the pictures of the car, of the car. I understand, just stupid reasons. So after that, I was like, ah, this insurance company. So now, now my own insurance. If I fuck up my car, like for example, uh, the G wagon was fucked up. It needed about eight hundred thousand or so. I'm I'm ready for whatever that can happen to any of the casts that that they're they're off maintenance. So the reason why I'm asking is because uh, I wanna understand. Have you been through something of that nature so whereby on, on my you, side, you, on my, you can on, be your own insurance. On, you have enough exactly, money. On my mm -hmm. side, on my side, I feel like for me, me personally, I'm with Discovery. And your know, thirteen thousand is a lot. I mean, my M eight is sitting at like nine, and that's a three and a half million rand car, well, two point eight. Oh, but you understand? Uh, at nine, nine. I'll let you check. Nine, nine. I think nine thousand three hundred. A premium. Yes. For which car? M eight competition. My M eight. Why is it? 
Eh, but no, it's still expensive because when they advertise, they advertise six hundred on TV. No, but they're talking about they, they they they're talking about Polo one point six liters. <laughs> or Picantos, not not the cars we're driving. <laughs> <laughs> Someone's like, didn't Marco buy a 17k shirt? What's 17k, guys? Come on, man. Guys, I bought a GoFro for 30,000. That was over 30. 30, 36. Shit. I just, I just, I just bought, I just, I just bought a Dolce Gabbana jacket yesterday for 44. So. Dolce Gabbana. Oh, I see. Dutch. Oh, Dutch and Gabbana. Oh, okay. Shit. I now nah, I'm not into fishing. I would never. I I can I can I can buy anything else that's worth hundred thousand. I can buy a phone. Even this. I can buy. Even, even even this. Even this. Even this here. I'm sure everybody saw the price of it. It was it was one hundred and thirty-two thousand. Uh, that gown. The tag is still here. I haven't taken the tag off. I haven't taken the tag off. It's still here. For 450, if you ask the right people. Let me just. You won't be able to see it. But let me. Let me. I'll show you it. You'll see. Like, even, even Louis Vuitton blankets. I love brands. Like, that's me. Even here. This is a Kenzo. I don't know if you know Kenzo. This is Kenzo. Even the price tag is still here. I mean, you can see it. 25,000. Kenzo King, it's a blanket. Yeah, blanket. So when you wear this blanket, like, are you going to be next to Jesus when you die? or what? Is Probably. Why <laughs> is it 25,000 for a blanket, Marco? I look, bought blankets I'm, the other day. I'm saying it. Look here, look here, look here, look here. Yeah, blankets. look here, look here, look here. When are you spending... Eh? Hundred and thirty-one thousand nine hundred and ninety-five. For the Versace. Yeah. It's not the normal one. Hundred and thirty-one thousand. So when when this one, if you buy it, ne, it means yeah. It means Marco. This is the normal one. This is the one everybody has. This one here. This is the Everyone, one everybody what do you mean has. Everyone has. This niggas in South Africa don't have. No, I'm saying this one here. Everybody has the normal one. But the one that I have now that I showed you is not this one. I even have a red one like that. I've got a yellow one like that. You can see here, here's a red one. And I've got a yellow one. These ones, I have three or four of them even. So those ones are normal. See here, even here, here's the jacket. Check here. Uh, and then when they are dirty, do you do you still wash them with Omo? The same ones. We have time to wash them with Omo. Let me put the light on here. Nobody has time do to wash, wash them, with them with Omo, or you wash with them with something. Different? Who's gonna wash them with Omo? What I'm saying is, if you look at my closet, check here. Okay. What what do you wash them with? <laughs> yeah, this is Versace. You can see here. How much is that one? Uh, this is the price day. Let's check. Uh, sixty nine. Uh, uh, sixty nine ranta or sixty nine thousand. Who the fuck is wearing sixty nine? <laughs> Zero, I would never. Even if I have is, 100 is, billion, I would never. This is for something that I'm gonna wash with Omo. Ah, we're mad. So I've got this one. I've got this is comes now. So I've got this one. I've got the black one. So you can see I've got the black one. I've got the green one. Even here, uh, if you look at something like this, this is even more, man. This one here, this is Montclair. This is Monclay. Haven't worn it yet. This is Monclay. I think it's also sitting at that region. 70. 
much? 70. Yeah, oh, there. Are these things want you to smoke weed? Uh, no, I no, I'll never. I would never. I would rather go do BBL. Mm -mm. Ah, well. 79, what, cost, 7, yeah. what must happen? <laughs> ah, hey. Most these people, Marco, these guys, got to send this 37,000. Even here, yeah, look at this gopher. This is I a know, if I buy this one, I qualify to sit with Jesus wherever he is. Oh, yeah, yeah. I'm not going to. 37,000. What For is that? Gopher. Which Billion item? A. Yeah, Billionaire Gopher. It's a t-shirt. Gopher. Gopher. Hmm. Where is it gopher -ing? And this is the Louis Vuitton one. You can see here. How much? This one here. Hey, Louis Vuitton yeah, doesn't keep their prices. It's still brand new. Haven't much, won it yet. How much, how much did you get it for? Uh, uh, I think it was sitting in the 20, 26,000, if I'm not mistaken. I think somewhere there. But what I'm saying is, a lot of the stuff here is brand new. I have even had tags on them. These ones are sitting at the 15,000 mark. Yeah, you see, 15. Thousand. These ones are sitting there, Max. I mean, these are just Versace, 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 Versace. How oh, much is, Versace. is your, when you are just estimating spiritually, how much is the worth of your wardrobe, Mark? How many millions? Yo. See this boot here, 60,000. How much are those boots? 60,000. Do you know why I would never buy them, Marco? This one well, specific kind. I can never buy a shoe that is worth 60,000 that is not publicly written, the name. That thing is not even written. That is Gucci. You literally yeah, yeah. have to own one to know it's worth. Oh, Marco, you, that one is better. This one is better, at least publicly, it can show that it's Gucci. That other one for 60,000, <laughs> I. <laughs> I, yo, I, I've got yo, and these things are brand new. I haven't worn them yet. Even this one. This is Philip Plain. Philip Plain is another brand as well. Yeah. How much is that? Twenty. What was it? What's it? Twenty something. For a and then this shoe. is Balenciaga. Still brand I know, new. Uh, oh, I've seen this ones online, I think. Those mm -hmm. type of this, this is Javinci. Brand new. Haven't worn it yet. Javinci. There's so many things I haven't worn yet. Here's another Balenciaga. I haven't worn. This is a Speed 2. I've seen that one on one rich nigga that I know. That one. I've seen it. Makes sense. How much is it? 30, 40, 25? 30. 28. 30. Yeah. 28. Oh, yeah, almost 30. Okay, makes sense. But then, yeah, this is what we, what we buy. We buy Tony Gavana. Do you have socks of this brand as well? Yep. How much are the socks? I'm concerned. Like hmm? I'm really concerned. Uh, how much is the... Just estimation. Because I've seen people wearing uh, the socks, the LV, the socks, the Gucci. Those ones, are, I want to know if they are claiming or not. You, you, they're about 8,000. The how they're, much? They're, they're about, about eight. Eight what? Eight thousand. Marco. Hmm. These things, socks. This. This ones that I got, eighteen of them at hundred rand. This ones. They are how much there? 
8,000. Hey, what must happen? These things are not cheap. See, and then these are like my perfume. These are, so these are my normal day, everyday perfumes. Those are colognes, all of them. Yeah, and these are my exclusives. How much is the exclusive one? I know these ones, yeah, are sitting in the 12,000, 15,000 range. Yeah, 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 yeah. Guys, Lena, I look at the other one, I look at the X Lady Shield, Jeja Lena. Let the other one, I look at the X Jeja Lena, I'll fetch your spray, or carbo spray, I'll charge you. Yeah, let the other one go. Bor, oh, I know that one. Oh, what is that one? That big bottle, I've seen it. Oh, yeah, that, that's the, uh, Christian Joe. Oh, Christian Joe. yeah, I can see. I've seen the brand. How much is that one? 6,000, ne? Seven. Which one? The big bottle, like this. It's like nine. Oh, this um, bottle is big. Yeah, this bottle is big. The but they started like around like six, this. seven, ne? The ones like this are like six and a half. Yeah. I've, this I've is the most. This like is the most. This is the most expensive. Just go Google it. The moon. Then you How come much? Back to, huh? Okay, let me Google. Hmm. Uh, the, the moon. Yeah. Cologne. Yeah. Look at what a fifty mil is. Go, go, go. Just go and look at the moon. Okay, I am seeing uh, twenty-one thousand. Is it correct? That's a fifty mil. What is that mill that you have? The, the one, the one, the one that I have here. This one here is a is a hundred mil, the big one, the hundred mil. Mill price. Uh, I'm only finding, I'm only finding fifty. Yeah, Google can be stupid sometimes. Okay, so the fifty mil is twenty one. It's it's yeah, but then yeah, this one here, was, yeah, this one here is uh, thirty three. Thirty-three thousand. Yes. Every one there's someone who smells like shield every day. When you are you are smelling thirty-three thousand. Yes. Guys, white people are living. <laughs> and then this one what? here. You see this one here. Uh, this one here is too nice. These are uh, all from Stim Collection. What is the name? Huh? What is the it's, name? How do you pronounce the Ibiscus. name? Hibiscus. 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 This is also nice. Ibiz I don't know if you know it. Hibiscus Mahalaid. Yeah. Creed. Creed is also nice. Uh, Creed. These are, the ones, yeah. these are the ones we hit. To, this, these are the ones that I go to in the club. And then these ones here are the ones that we wear all day, every day. Versace, your first. These are the normal ones that we just put on to smell like shield. Yeah, I know. These are the ones. The other ones are very far from smelling like shield. But these ones are just Dolce & Gabbana, Vincent Klein, Gentleman, Savage, the older Savage, you. Mm -hmm. Yeah, these are just the normal ones. Jean-Paul Gaultier. Yeah. Okay, they're asking on the comments, Mark. They're saying, so when it's like this, what kind of condoms do you use? Do you use the normal ones <laughs> or your condoms is like 10,000? <laughs> I wear Gucci. Imagine, imagine telling, imagine telling someone, I wear, imagine telling someone I wear Gucci. Imagine telling someone I wear Gucci. Gucci. And then if you want to come rob me, ne? you must come. I'm ready for you. I'm waiting for you. Yeah. Okay. Yes, you must have. It's a standard procedure. Must come. You, yeah, you. it's a standard procedure. And I don't play. I've got hollow points. I can show you. I've got hollow points. When it hits you, you'll explode. Yeah, I, mean, <laughs> I make sure. I make sure when I when, when when it hits you, when I hit, when I shoot you, and I make, I make sure. I make sure one one bullet. I make sure one bullet will take you, will take you to your father in heaven. One bullet. So you must make sure when you imagine, come here, you must, you must make sure, because when I hit you with one bullet. Imagine you are dying, uh, you're joining your father, you're dying poor, your father died poor, fuck. You, <laughs> you. <laughs>
you must make make you must you, you you must make sure when you come here and you try something, because if I can hit you with one bullet, <laughs> you'll know. I, I they won't even live to tell the story. I, they they won't even live to tell the story. No, they won't. They won't. I know. With a hollow with a hollow point, I'll finish you. With a hollow point, I you you you, you won't live to see him the next day. Marco. From your diamonds, your Versace, your what what I even forgot some of these things. Even, your gowns, yeah, here's a Versace, Versace, thousand, Versace, your cologne, plate. Even the, this is the air plate. plate. This is the air plate. Wait, whoa. how much is that plate? Eleven. Eleven what? Thousand. thousand. When you buy that plate, you can. It has food forever. You eat one, no. then get full forever. This one is the air freshener for the house. You see? How much is the air freshener? Three, three thousand, somewhere there. I'm coming. <laughs> Marco, how much is your air freshener? Three thousand. Oh my God. His life is not fair. <laughs> it's the same yeah. as. Yeah. This is like 33 <laughs> rand. <laughs> when you shit, you are using this. Marco is using an air fresh now, whatever. It's the, same as, it's the same as the candles. I'm taking it. It's the same as. The, it's the same as it's the same as candles. You see this candle? Yeah. yeah. Go Google the price on this candle. It's about one one point four. Uh, uh, what is the spelling? D. You can just check. T Q candle price. But it won't be less than nine hundred. Fuck! I'm even finding one worth eleven thousand, one six thousand, one point seven. Yeah. Totally the same. Brand. Yeah, this is, this is one. This, so, this one is one. This one was one point four. Let me just check. Yeah, this one was one point so four. What, and then, when you turn it on, ne? like when when you light it, does it? This one give was you one. Maybe signals 1. as well on Nasdaq, or what does it do? This mm, one. There's no it, signal there. Then what is the use, Mark? What is the use? Let's know. start there. What is what is the use of having a a candle is five friends, Marco. What is the use of having a candle? We are one My entertainment four. system, just we like yours. DJs, okay. At least I have this one. I've I've bought. Uh, I have a Nexus. I have the two thousand Nexus. I've bought each yeah, for three thousand. So these are nine hundred. These are nine hundred Nexus. Oh yeah, I, I have the two thousand Nexus. Hmm. Uh, the mixer is the same. Yeah, your mixer and mine are the same. But the yeah. decks. I actually have four decks. I have eight fifties and two thousand Nexus. Yeah, I can see. I so what do you use this for? You are a DJ as well. Entertainment, yeah. So, so Marco, you are telling me that you are fucking capable of booking black coffee to come perform for you while you are just drinking juice. Probably. And water at Probably. Black coffee charges 350000 So I with your have... bracelet, Elias speaker. The one worth two hundred, <laughs> three hundred thousand. You are actually, you can actually that one. Yes, you can actually afford to book Black Coffee to come play for you for two hours. Please, something like book that. Him. Book him and invite me, Marco. Book him and invite me. <laughs> and we are not going to use Glade. We are going to use that one. That fresh freshener, mm. yeah, three thousand. When he comes, Black Coffee, we are going to use eleven thousand plate, not. Uh, Twelve run plate from spa, for from spa, <laughs> and then slippers. How much do you buy them for? Your slippers? I've got Versace slippers. So I don't know, and I've got Louis Vuitton slippers. So over fifteen, I'm yeah. sure. Yeah, they're Jeez. sitting at about a, they, 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 the slippers are sitting at about nine, nine and a half. Jesus, Jesus. There's even blankets. As I said, you know, forty thousand in blankets. 
Marco, I bought my blanket just about a week ago. 1.3, I got four blankets. When I, we, what's so special? Do you dream we, meeting Jesus there? What, no, what, it's what, fun. What? Oh, oh. No, Marco, you are going to you are going to kill us, dog. I swear, you you are literally going to kill us, Castres. And then, and then, you see, even here we've got a Versace pillow. How much is that pillow? This pillow here. Yeah. yeah. I think I've got a set. So the set, the set for four was 30, 31, I think. Yeah. Set they of four. Mm. For a pillow. No. Four pillows, man. It doesn't matter. For a pillow. Yeah, for a pillow. It's... How much is that cap? This is D. Uh, this is D squared. About what? Four, four and a half, four thousand. Four, four and a half. But I've got, I've got more expensive caps. I've got Philippine. I've got a Versace. I've got Prada. I've got. I showed you the time. Now, I showed being, you. Being honest with you, being honest with you, I'm not inspired. I'm depressed. You. But I even you, showed you, you even here. Okay, see, this is this is this is just a shopping. I haven't I haven't thrown the the, the the bags away for this month. I'll throw them away probably. Ah. Marco, you are it's uh, you are depressing.